Hello and welcome to AFK here on the Loading Ready Run Network. I'm your host, Ben, and joining me is Matt Ooh. and Nelson. I'm Nelson. Yo, we got Nelly up in here. and Hi. Uh, This is my first time on AFK. Yeah, uh, we don't have like an official like christening uh, process. I'm going to be sacrificed to the game. Yeah, right? yeah. yeah. I mean, at the end of this, uh, only one of us time. can survive, right? Yeah. Yeah, yeah. yeah for sure. <laughs> Uh, yeah, we are going to be playing Fate of the Elder Gods today. This game seems super, super cool. I'm really, really pumped to play it. Uh, and it is kind of continuing the flavor of playing spoopy uh, board games for the entire month of October. Ooh. The best month of the year. Yeah. Um, but uh, before we get in on how to play it and all that kind of jazz, a reminder that this stream is brought to you by the amazing folks over at WormwoodGaming.com. Uh, if you want to get one of their amazing products, like, for example, this dice tray, too, that we're, we're using, they're very, very nice, very handy, um, you, and you live in the U.S., you can use code LRR for free shipping, and everywhere else in the world, you can use code LRRWORLD for $10 off shipping. Many work hours and a really nice tree were sacrificed so that this dice tower or a tray could come into Yeah, being. yeah, exactly. Could be summoned we're, up from and the... And Paul? <laughs> Wormwood Gaming, the bones of trees and the skins of beasts. Nice. Whoa. Yeah. <laughs> did I just get patted uh, on the belly? Is that what? Did I just a get little bit, yeah. Ian, <laughs> Ian, <laughs> Ian pats me on the belly, ephemeral. <laughs> I've never felt so close to Mr. Horner. <laughs> he cares about it. Yeah, no, I get it. Yeah. I, I know now. Yeah, yeah. Well, yeah, you, you, you'll you learn all the AFK memes now. <laughs> Excellent. Yeah. Uh, and a reminder that uh, everything we do is brought to you by you over at our Patreon at patreon.com slash loadingreadyrun. You're the reason we're able to do all kinds of awesome things. Uh, you did this. Yeah, like for example, uh, Nelly and Adam are going to be coming to Command Fest. Command Fest Seattle. We're going to roll up and hopefully make you proud. Command yeah. Daddy. Yeah. Oh, <laughs> I'll I'll take that title. Hell yeah, Command Daddy. Maybe maybe some of Ben's decks are going too. We'll oh, see. Yeah, I mean, I could I could definitely ship. This you is off me too. officially announcing my plea for help. Oh yeah, <laughs> I will absolutely uh, aid in that kind Great. of thing. Thank you. Hell yeah. Um, and there are other ones coming up, but we don't want to give those away because there's some uh, secrety stuff. Being coming an LRR up. Patreon. Uh, it's got to have surprise benefits sometimes. Right? It does, yeah, yeah, yeah exactly. absolutely. And a lot of that is like the kind of upcoming. Oh, speaking of upcoming cool things, yeah. Uh, in like a couple of days on Monday, uh, it's the premiere of Road Quest episode oh, wow. one. That's right. Yeah. Uh, you did that too. Much anticipated. Yeah, right, that's coming yeah. Fast and now. Uh, having the opportunity to to watch the first couple episodes. Holy moly! It it came together really really well. I literally was hired. Work on that. <laughs> yeah. And now and now you're gonna do all the other cool stuff with us too. That's yeah. I mean that's just how I, loading ready run do. It just I, took a year. <laughs> I'm gonna do my best to avoid cliche hype phrases, so attach your safety restraints. Yeah. Road quest is coming. <laughs> so I'm really, really pumped for that. It's gonna be great. Um yeah, so and thank you. It's because of all your support that we're able to do things like that. So uh all right, let's talk about uh, Fate of the Elder Gods. Um, we're going to kind of give a little bit more in depth on, on this one because it's got a couple of weird nuances to it, but it's fairly straightforward when you kind of understand what each of the zones do and stuff. So, and as you can tell already, a lovely neon color palette of plastic figures. Yeah, yeah. there is one that's like dark uh, green. Yeah, the, oh, okay, there's a yeah, green too. There's like a dark green one, but we decided to not use that one so that everyone Everyone could see things a little bit Lovely. better. Yeah, it's a little. It pops out, so you guys can kind of see what's going on. Um, so each of us is uh, is a cult. Each of us is a different cult, in fact, and mm -hmm. each of us wants to summon our own elder god, uh, and we are going to be doing that by effectively um, sacrificing our, our, our cultists and doing other shenanigans in the attempt uh, to earn uh, nine. Uh, I don't know, summoning points. Yeah. Elder signs, I think? Yeah. Well, elder, elder signs are like the, the bad kind of things that can happen, I guess. Oh, yeah. um, but like the idea is to get nine summony e points. We all start at zero, and by doing various things, we can um, uh, uh, we can each get nine. And the first nine person to do that. Nine signs of fate, maybe. So yes. That, uh, you know, now I like that. summoning is nine. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Um, alternatively, there's also another backup kind of one. Right. Uh, there are bad things that can happen that actually hinder us from uh, getting to summon our gods. Uh, and they put little uh, elder signs, as we were saying, around each of our summoning points. Um, and if somebody gets exactly 10 
of those, the game is over. The investigators have stopped us, basically. Okay. And the winner is the uh, one, the other two, one of the other two people who has the most of the summoning. The points. closest to getting their elder card yeah. down I, yeah. without being discovered and yeah, probably I, slain. I feel I feel like it's worthwhile to point out that the bad thing that can happen is that the good guys win. Yeah, fellow humans. <laughs> yeah, yeah, we are we is that you, destroying are our evil baddies, plot? Paul? Yeah, the bad the the bad thing that can happen is that you guys fail to bring about apocalypse. You know. Yeah, life is subjective. Yeah, and. Yeah. Uh, from the cultist's point of view. Well, we're gonna find out. <laughs> yeah. So, uh, the game is basically uh, taken one turn at a time, and, and on our turn, we'll basically be going through four phases. Uh, there's move, or sorry, prepare, move, activate, conclude. So, uh, during the prepare phase, uh, we get to unexhaust artifacts or use any uh, readied spells you want to. It's kind of like, I hate using magic terms, but sometimes it's just the easiest way to describe it's it. Untapped. We untap our artifacts. Yeah, yep. <laughs> I like that they they maybe made up a word in unexhaust, unexhaust. rather than just saying refresh. Was refresh taken? Well, that's Are the thing. You Paul, to... Paul and I have noted that in a lot of board games, they'll yeah. say exhaust and unexhaust, or Weird. yeah, refresh or whatever. Yeah. So shout out to Watsy uh, <laughs> for taking the easiest term ever to explain <laughs> that. But that's exactly what it was. Okay. There it is. Uh, and so, yeah, it's kind of like the, the phase where we sort of re you reset everything. Uh, then you go to the move step. And the move step, you do three things. The first is move. So uh, you have a, each of us has a hand of three cards that we've got. Them. And as out. you can see, there are symbols on the backs of these cards. And if you kind of go to the, the, the zoom out, you can see that each area on this altar corresponds to a different symbol. And you effectively sort of move this big guy here, the Fate Token. It's a big Cthulhu statue. There he is. And so on your turn, you can play one of your cards to move to a location that on here. So for example, I could play this green card and I could move over here to the gathering. So what I would do is I would take that move card, pop it down and leave it behind here in the, the other world and move the Fate guy over here. That's the first part of it. The second part is activate that area. So you perform the basic action. So for example, in the gathering area, we get to uh, effectively uh, get more troops. I'll kind of explain what each area does um, after we kind of go through the move stuff. But that's what you do. You activate its basic function. Then if you have three or more and the most amount of cultists in that area, you get to perform the control action. Right. You can choose to do it. And usually it's like a steroided version or extra cool thing of the basic action. This is where your cultists storm the facility, take out all the security guards, yeah. and then they are running the library and they put on you know, the skin of the librarian. Yeah. I mean the clothes of yeah. the librarian. Also noting, yeah. when you move there, on top of the fact that you uh, get to, uh, or sorry, I guess the, the main thing, is um, you are putting a, uh, from your lodge area, where we have some backup units, uh, you're putting one of your troops up in there, as well as an investigator. And the investigators are these gray uh, ones. And if there are three or more investigators when you move on up into there, uh, you take all those investigators and you put them on the card in your lodge. Uh, and this is important because eventually they perform a raid and do some terrible things when you reach the critical mass, which is typically, uh, I believe, five. Um, that's Red sort Chase of... Jeff understands. Exactly. Yeah. Okay. Um, so yeah, and that's what you do. You move there, you check to see if you need to take any uh, 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 investigators up into your lodge, and then perform the, the basic action or the control action. So in each one of them just have that action written onto the board? Is yeah, right? effectively. Okay, and you've cool. got a handy dandy card oh, cool. too also tells that'll you actually here. explain uh, what each one does. And we'll go through them there okay. again too. Okay. Um, Sorry, back to the turn. Yeah, yeah, no, no. And, and one thing I, I did forget to mention is if at any point maybe you're vying for control, like it's tied, right. you can choose to roll a dice. And if you get a ha the, the correct symbol you're looking for, which in this case I believe is the tentacle or the Cthulhu head, uh, you temporarily get control for your turn. Okay. There. Even like, if you aren't, even if can, you aren't, in can control. you do it? Even if you're not tied, like you, I, I roll in here. You have three of your cultists. I only have the one that I just put down. And I can still roll the die. Yeah. Okay. Exactly. Is there is there a downside to doing that? Was that was going to be my next question. Yes. Oh, yeah. uh, and off the top of my head, right. when you roll dice, there should be a price. Yeah. Um, yeah. Yeah. It's uh, there's there. That's that's the the one big portion of here. Um, 
do, 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 do. Yeah, you, on a result of the Cthulhu head, your cult gains temporary control and you can take it. Um, there appears to be no downside. Okay, so this is an oh. action you will always perform. Yeah. Unless we want a house roll that if you don't get a Cthulhu head, you have to do five push-ups or something. Oh, God, I will <laughs> never roll that dice. And Nelson wasn't invited back to AFK. <laughs> <laughs> I'm trying to think. I don't think there is. Yeah, That's fine. I don't think there is specifically. We've that. got 300 people reading yeah. the rules at the same time, so if it turns out there's a downside, just text us. Yeah. Just let us know. I mean, yeah, the, the Cthulhu just head chat. is the, the one. I'm sure somebody yeah. who's got the... We've got a it's, couple of people who are really good only, at knowing that There's stuff. only one of those on the dice. Right? There is only yeah. one of those on the dice, and the other are different symbols. Yeah. So the only risk is the time you spend rolling the die. Yes, yeah, exactly. So sorry. And energy. That we've risks. gone through... Yeah, yeah. Okay. So we've gone through the move, we've gone yeah. through the activate, once you do your kind of thing. And finally, the last thing is the conclude. Uh, and during this, you may ready a spell, which is the cool kind of part. So on the other side of these cards in our hands, there are spells. And you kind of see on the top down, they have differing kind of uh, uh, costs, the co costs and, and colors on them. And the way that you do that is you may, as you saw at the beginning, when we're moving around, we're leaving behind symbols in, in each of these uh, zones from the cards. So for example, when I was I moving to the that. gathering, I, I left a thing here, right? Is it wherever the elder token came Where from? Where you're moving from. from? Okay, yes. you put down a spell yeah. from your hand? Yeah, to the place okay. you're moving to. Okay, right? oh, I see. Right, right, right. Okay, yeah. so, okay. And All so, right. for example, if I wanted to, uh, if, if you're trying to, uh, when you're trying to cast a spell, you look at the things that are on the top here. So, for example, on this one, I would need uh, a yellow, uh, a green, a green, and a white. Was it the yellow, or just... Oh, sorry, no, it's just... not. It's just the top. So I would need a green, a green, <coughs> and a, a, a white mm. to do the th this spell that I'm trying to do. Yeah. This is the only kind of complicated part of it. So if you look here in the other worlds, if, for example, I, the, the Fate Token was here and we were doing things in this right. area, you'll note that there are two green symbols mm -hmm. and the gate symbol. Now, the gate is the, is the purple, and gates are actually wild. They can be used for anything. Right. So in this instance, I would be able to use the Confound spell. Oh, um, now, what you do is you ready it. And you can you can just basically show everybody, hey, look, look I've uh, I've I'm fulfilled I fulfilled the price of this, right. and you put it down. And now you can choose to activate that whenever the hey you want to. Any turn, any time. Yeah, you can do it right now if you wanted to. You could hang on to it for later. But worth noting, the longer you keep it down here, mm -hmm. when you're casting spells in your future, you can use this as a symbol for okay. casting other spells. And uh, you unlike when you're casting um, when you after you've ready to spell from here because once you've ready to spell from here you get rid of anything that was in that area and okay. put it to the discard pile. The cards. Okay. This will stay. Okay. So this is like a permanent little yellow symbol for you for until you want to use it for its yeah. effect. And worth okay. noting, regardless of which symbols you're using in what's called this is referred to as the astral column. Right. Uh, you don't. Uh, it doesn't. It doesn't matter if they're not used. If a spell is ready using this location. The entire astral column goes away. Okay. Does that make sense? Yeah, in case there were like seven cards here. Yeah. You obviously only ever need three. Yeah. It seems like all the casting costs are three. And but then, you just always just wipe the astral column exactly. clean. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, they all get discarded, and then if you run out of uh, spell cards, they just shuffle them on up. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. Um, yeah, so that's cool. basically it. You can ready a spell. You can only have a maximum of three readied spells at a time. Um, and for example, let's just go, if I were to use that confound spell, I get to move all. Uh, investigators from one location to an adjacent location, or I get to destroy all of the uh, investigators in my lodge. Okay. So if that 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 should make sense, kind of from what we've sort right. of talked about. It seems like sometimes they end up in your lodge because you're taking control of the location. But yes. But then later that'll be a problem. Yes. Right. So the final thing that happens. You only want so many investigators up in your lodge. Yeah. Right. Yeah. You gotta so, do some devious stuff in there. Yeah. Exactly. And there's two final things that happen in the in the concluded time. So after you've ready your spell, if you want to, you don't have to. You draw one card or back up to three. So okay. if you've got four cards and you, because you, you definitely can, yeah. you draw, you get still get to get one. You move to five, or if you're at one or two, you drop up to up three, to three okay. or zero. I believe there's one thing we missed in the move step is if you have two of the same color, you can spend them like a while. You can right? spend them both to go wherever you want. Yes, like a gate. Yes, right, thank yeah. you. Sorry, I did forget about that. Um, and the final thing that happens is if you have five or more. Um, uh, investigators. investigators in your lodge, they perform a raid. And that's a bad thing oh. that you don't want to have happen. Oh, yeah. when it uh, what okay. you do is you take a dice for each 
uh, investigator that is in your lodge. Yeah. And for each star, uh, for each elder sign or each elder star that shows up on the dice, uh, they kill your dudes. Okay, so you <laughs> lose their cultists. I, I believe that's exactly how. Uh, I thought it was just the ones in your seals. lodge. No, I don't oh, okay. think you get. Yeah, oh, right, cultists no, you get don't seals. die, but you get yeah. seals. Yeah, oh, the which cultists is, are gonna die. Which is yeah. arguably worse. In yeah. ten seals, the game's over. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. Exactly. Okay. And I believe if you roll an elder sign, which it looks like a branch. Yeah. Oh, okay. Sorry. Sorry. It is actually different. Yeah. Yeah. So it's elder signs, which is the little star kind of thing. Yeah. Uh, one investigator remains on your lodge with the elders. Uh, this. Yeah. With with. One investigator remains on your lodge. With the Elder Sign complete, the tenacious investigator feels emboldened to continue the righteous task. Uh, if you get, you gain one Elder Sign if you get the little scar kind of thing, uh, and you destroy that investigator. Yeah. They go away. Uh, or, if you get the Tentacle or the Cthulhu head, you actually get to destroy an investigator in your lodge. So they just leave. Basically. Yes. Yeah. Okay. So really, the main ones you... the, the I, I, Yeah, I kind of paraphrased, I guess. The stars are, they stay, okay. and they, you get a sign. The scars are they leave us, they put a sign and they go away, yeah. and the tentacles destroy the investigator. Definitely going to need to have that reminds me. When yes, I when it raided. actually happens. Yeah. yeah, you'll get it in doing. And there, are, I'm sure we'll get raided at some point. There are other situations that can cause raids. Too. Yes. Yeah. yeah. So Mewtwo is feeling frisky. That's yeah. Sort of yeah. Exactly. Yeah. So that's that's how it kind of goes. And like I said, that's a lot of information. Um, but the main thing to n you note is you're effectively doing one like one sort of like action on your turn you're moving to a place you're activating that place and then you're writing a spell and checking on investigators and stuff like that so that's the main thing so let's briefly go over what each of the places do and then let's just get into the game because i, think I, I, be I also way. want to have one more question but let's find out what the places do first. sure okay. okay so let's go around the board starting with the other world so the other world uh its basic action is you can roll one dice for each cultist that you've got in that area, and for each tentacle or Cthulhu head, you can sacrifice, which is to take one of your to to kill a, a dude on that spot and send him to the void, um, uh, and to advance your summon track one space for okay. each of the things. Um, and if you can afterwards, if you control that once you if, if you once you do the basic, you can also do the control action for each um, Cthulhu head that you roll. You can return one of your uh, uh, cultists okay. from the abyss to your lodge. Okay. And that's that's the whole thing for the other world. Cool. Okay. okay. Moving along, let's go to the museum. All so right. the museum, you can see that there's cool little artifacts here. This is where we talked about the tippity-tapping mm -hmm. uh, abilities and stuff. Yeah. So the basic action is you get to go to the museum, and you can grab either one of these or uh, the top card one. of this. Sure. Okay. Right? Um, and they vary in range of things. Like, for example, this lamp is, you can either, this doesn't have a tap ability. It's a one-time thing. You can discard it to roll three dice. For each uh, scar or sign that you get, uh, you gain an Elder Seal, which is just bad. Okay. But then you get to take an immediate second turn. Oh, wow. Oh, wow. Which is pretty cool. Um, other ones have tap abilities as well, as you can see on there. Um, so the literal thing that you just do there, you get to go here, grab a thing. If you control it, you can do the action of, you can discard and replace the artifact display, which is these ones. Okay. Then you can sacrifice up to three uh, cultists from the museum to destroy a uh, elder sign from any one, for, from any one lodge for each uh, dude that you sacrifice. Okay, so it's So that's the, how you can get rid of elder signs. It's the interaction. Yeah. Yeah, sure. Yeah. There's the ceremony, which is you gain one gate card, which yep. is that those cards down there, and can be used, as I mentioned before, as a wild card for... Sure. Moving anywhere or for casting spells uh, too? Yeah, or? yeah. Well, for casting spells, if you place them, okay. if they're placed down somewhere. I okay. believe you can have max of one. You can have max of one, and they do not count towards your hand size. Okay. Uh, and then afterwards, you get to activate your dude's special ability. Each oh. of us has a god with a different special ability. Yep. Which we can sort of uh, like. For example, we'll talk about mine. I won't say who it. Uh, I won't say who it is yet. But I can look at one spell card from any location's astral spell column. Okay. And choose to just ready it at no cost. Neat. Okay. And that's my kind of thing. Okay. Um, and then if you control it, what you get to do is you can sacrifice two cultists from that area to advance one space on your summon track. Okay. So that's another way that you can advance so, yeah, your summon track. Two ways to win the game. Yeah. Right? The easiest okay. way, obviously, is to do it in the other world, but the ceremony can help you because, worth noting, the only way to get to the other world is with a gate card. I see. Or with two of the 
Same, right. Okay. Uh, it's more color. expensive to travel there. Though. It is. Okay. It's a tougher one. Okay. Uh, there's the streets of Arkham. This one can best be described as the way to deal with investigators. Yeah. Uh, because what you can do is if you get to the streets of Arkham, uh, the basic action is to take two uh, investigators from your lodge yeah. or from the dis- uh, supply and put them onto other places. Now okay, you can you put, put them up. Yeah. yeah, you can take either two and put it onto one person or you can go one and one. Okay. It's up to you. Then they raid right okay. away. <laughs> on who on both? On, or on whoever you pl- oh, yeah, on whoever you placed so on onto. One or both. Okay. On, on yeah, uh, basically everybody but you gets raided. Sure. All other lodges. Yeah. yeah. Okay. Uh, and if you control it after the raid, yeah. You can sacrifice one cultist from the streets of Arkham to uh, place one uh, cultist on every other lodge. Investigator. 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 Yeah. Sorry. Yeah, okay. they use they do this thing where they use the symbols instead of the, the people and it always is like right. yeah. you're like right, 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 right. You gotta remember. Uh, all right. Two more spaces to go. I gotta slot information. The gathering. Magic. Okay. This is how you get friends back. Okay. Uh, from the void. Gotcha. Effectively. Uh, so you can return three cultists from the abyss to your lodge. Um, and then you may move one of your cultists from the gathering to any location on the altar. Okay. Uh, if you control it, afterwards you may move any number of your uh, cultists from the gathering to any other location. Okay. Okay. And then finally, the library. And this is kind of the spell zone. Right. Um, you draw three spell cards, right? Just right away, uh, and you may ready one additional spell this turn. If you okay. control it. You can sacrifice one cultist from the library to ready a spell at no cost. Sacrifice one cultist to ready a spell. Yeah. Oh, from your hand, though. Yes. Unlike that. Yeah. Okay. At no cost. At, at no, no cost. cost. Cool. Yeah. Okay. And yeah, you've got the you got the card that that, that kind sure, of breaks them down and helps them out too. Gotcha. Uh, but that's what each area does. So yeah, you you, cool. you you perform the the four phases and then it passes to the next person. So my only other question was just yep. how do we get victory points, right? And mm-hmm. it looks like there's two spots on the board that we do it. Exactly. Do you think there's another one? or There might just... be spells maybe that would oh, okay, help okay. doing that. Yeah. And, cool. Or maybe um, artifact. Like, th- right. some of the artifacts okay. or spells might do it. Okay, yeah. there's no other information that we need to know to start playing. Yes. That's great. Amazing. Well, there's one last thing. Oh, okay, great. Curses. Here's my arm. Yeah. Curses. <laughs> so, curses happen to people in some mystery way. Sometimes have, there's... The card is the... I don't know if you can see on the drop-down better, but it's uh, it's the cover of the book, The Secret. Mm-hmm. So we know what the publishers think of yeah, that. Yeah, exactly. yeah, exactly. Uh, there's one known way, okay. right off the bat, that we can get them. And is if if our little if our, if our little summoning uh, cert token goes yeah. around and we at any point go inside one of the Elder Signs that are on our thing, right. we get cursed. Okay. Yeah. Uh, that only curse, happens once. Yeah, that only happens once. Not for each one you go through. Okay. Um, there are also spells and other things that can happen to curse you. Sure. Um, but how a curse works is, let's say Nelson got cursed. Hi. Yeah. Matt would grab a curse card, take a look at it, read it, and at the top of the curse card is a condition for that curse to take effect. Okay. And then what happens once that happens? Once it takes effect? It's okay. Matt's job to pay attention to when you make that happen. It's or if you make card. that happen. Cool. It's yeah. basically a trap card. Right. Yeah. yeah. So we know, that we, we all get to know that our curses are coming, yeah. but you, know, you don't know what you're, our, you don't, yeah. It's up to our you. friends to let us know exactly, exactly. what happens. Yeah. Okay, and, what, and what's going to happen. Yeah. So cool. it's, it's very interesting. So you might be able to duck it. Yes. It, it, the Sword of Damocles doesn't always fall on your head. Right? Yeah. So uh, that's basically it. I'm going to grab each of your cards here. Oh, and we're gonna order. and we're gonna say this is gonna figure out the turn order and also who's playing who. Right. So I have been given first by myself. I am playing Yog Sathoth, the uh, the lurker at the threshold. Matt is playing uh, Nyarlathotep. <laughs> yes, the Yarl. crawling chaos, and uh, Nelson's playing Haster. Ironically, he who him who is not to be named, even though he's the only one with a pronounceable name. Whoops. <laughs> yeah. Him who is not named, oops. Just to tilt you. Yeah. Yeah. If you say this name that you can, we're gonna get you. And uh yeah, you do you, I guess do you want to read out whatever our abilities do? Yes. Cool. So I told you mine is uh and remember these abilities are activated if we go and do a thing at the ceremony. So. Um so for example, mine is like we said, look at the one spell card from any of the location's astral column, and I can choose to ready it at no cost if I would like, um, or I can discard it. Mm-hmm. Matt, what's your ability? Masks. I destroy one cultist from each other cult's lodge. 
Then I place one investigator on each other cult's lodge. Lovely. So it turns out that one of our cultists was like an investigator, turns I guess, out. in disguise. Yes. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Dance of the Outer Gods. Yours is wild. Starting from the ceremony, that's this part of the map, or the board, and proceeding clockwise. You may roll one die for each location on the altar where you have a cultist present. For each tentacle or Cthulhu face, place one cultist from your lodge in that location and move one investigator from there to any other location. Okay, so... Yeah, mine does a lot of things. You and get to reshuffle the entire moves, board. Yeah, yeah. Much, yeah, moves a bunch of my guys onto the field and moves a bunch of investigators around, but yeah. also brings a bunch to town. But the trick is you got to uh, you got to already have guys on all the places for it to work. Right. First, yeah. I have to have someone there. So that's exciting. Um, I'm gonna screw up using that and not use it to its best ability. Mm -hmm. Which is, I guess, actually, you have the guy there. Everyone, so everyone starts with one person on every place. Is that yeah. how that works? Yes. Yeah. So we've always got one kind of in the area. Um, okay. We ready to go? We'll uh, shuffle these up. And the person to go first is <laughs> Nelly. 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 All right. Hooray! I got to go first. So. Yeah. Here we are. Is everyone ready? Yes. Do we need to do any kind of like ritual dance or ceremonial? Everybody have, have a good have, time. Have a good and break. break. All right. <laughs> Prepare step. Unausting my, unexhausting my artifact. I'm gonna never say that again. Hopefully, untapping my artifacts. Done. Um, play an astral symbol. Move to a fate place. Move a fate piece to a location. Okay. So I don't know. I kind of like the fact that I already have. One guy on every place, so maybe yeah, I'll just you go can move to the ceremony. You want. The world is sort of your oyster at this point. So I need oh, but I would need to have a green or a white. Sorry, a white to go here. Yeah. So yeah. and I don't have two of the same one, so no. I can actually only go red, yellow, or blue. Mm -hmm. Great, that's fine. So yellow is streets of investigators messing everybody up, and you red is museum. library. Or I can go to the museum and get a. So do I want to get a bunch of magic, or do I want to get an artifact? Uh. Let me just read the artifacts. This is the time walk one, mm -hmm. and this is the uh, tap to move an investigator being placed in a lodge at any location instead, or this is like sacrifice. Yeah. Return to the supply up to two from those. That like protects you. The yeah. silk shroud of yeah, not getting you can investigated. Kind of send investigators elsewhere, mm -hmm. which those, seems pretty cool. Those both sound kind of sweet, but... You can only choose one. I'm going to stay true to my homies and just show up at the magic place and do a bunch of magic. All right, so That's it goes... So it goes there, right, yeah. so right, all right. So you leave it behind yep. wherever you're going to go. Then you move this here, right? Mm-hmm. Okay, now I place one of my buddies from the lodge and one of these guys from the supply yep. on this spot. So there are two oh. investigators there. Yes, maybe I'll put them So if somebody first. moves uh, to there. there, then, yeah, things will happen. Yeah. Okay. You also draw three spell cards. Or sorry, the, the check is before. So okay. they would they would move their uh, check if there's three or more. There is not. Okay. Then place one and place each of the, the ones right. on there, and the next person to move there would make it happen. So I may now roll a die for temporary control, right? Yeah. Because I'm here. Yes. And that's the roll. So yeah. I'll borrow a die, please. There you are. Thank you. Here we go. Rolling. We got not a Cthulhu head. No. Elder Star. Elder Star. Okay. Let's then keep going. Resolve the location ability. So that's draw three spells, right? Yes. This from right here? Mm -hmm. One, two, three. And you are now able to uh, prepare an extra spell if you would like. Prepare an extra spell. Okay. Uh, All you have to use as cost well, is the, the red and green. The oh, preparation right. is at the oh, yes, the, he's is at the end of the turn, right? Yes, Which, now he's in the conclude. It's, it's just that quick. All right. Yeah. I do have one that okay. I can ready for a red and a green. He can, can do indeed it. do it for a red and a green. So I get rid of this green one. Yes, yeah, so go into discard. the discard. Yep. Okay, face down, I guess. And okay. then this go. yellow mana is available to me. I should maybe read it, but I'll get back to that. <laughs> you didn't then, even know what you prepared. Well, I knew that it. I know that it gives me a yellow mana every turn. So that's that's that it. Seems yeah. worth doing even if I'm not planning to cast it. Yeah. Um, does this get replaced right away? Or not? No. No. It's, it's just it's, not there. So uh, someone has to move away from I, I think actually in this particular place, because you can do two spells, I think it's not actually discarded until the second spell. Oh. No, that um, makes sense. Okay. Don't, yeah, double check the description of the thing. But I, if I recall... That, that that makes a lot of sense. Good good call, Paul. Um, That's why we call him Good Call Paul. Mm -hmm. Astro symbols are not exhausted when used. Uh, and... 
All right. It's it would be uh, until after both spells have been readied. Yeah, okay. Okay. So this and it is for the basic action. So this should still be here it's, right it's, now. So now you have. But I don't have another spell I can cast. Okay. I only so had the now, one that I could do for just a red negri. Yeah. But you hypothetically, if you had it, you could have. If yeah, you would. Yeah. Or if it's like a big, it was you like could have stormed or something. off. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. yeah. yeah magic okay. terms. Sorry. Yeah. Okay. We are done. Mm-hmm. Okay. It's your turn, Ben. There you go. That's a whole turn. Woo! We did it. Woo! All right. Uh, so we're currently at the, the fate symbols at the library. Library. Yeah. Where? So I've got yellow, white, and. Oh, and it has to move every turn, by the way. Yeah. It you does. Can't, you yeah. Can't just stay there. You so must. I think I want to go to the ceremony. So I'm gonna play nice. a white. That looks fun. There, and I'm gonna go down on over to the ceremony. Uh oh. So we check. Uh, to see if there's uh, three or more investigators, there is not. Okay. So then we take one from the lodge, and one investigator, and put them in here. Uh, and then we do the basic action of that, which is gain a gate card, and, and then activate your unblinking eye. Yeah, my uh, my ability is uh, I can look at any one spell card from any location's astral column and decide if I want to ready it. Okay. So you know what. Uh, it's getting discarded afterwards, so I'm gonna go ahead and say, I don't know, this red one. Okay. Over here in the other worlds. Um, red. Yeah, we all hope Adam gets better too. Have Have we determined whether the color? Yes. <laughs> have we determined whether the color of the uh, the color of the back of the spell? is indicative of the type of spell, or is it totally... Random? I don't know. Maybe. The color of the back of the spell is also th present on the front of the spell above yeah, the name. I well, I don't know enough about the abilities of each yeah. one. Yeah. But, but how does this it work with the color pie? It, yeah. doesn't, it doesn't seem to connect to, as far as I can tell, the casting cost. Like, I have a, a blue card with a blue casting cost of blue, blue, blue. Yeah. And then I have a red spell with a casting cost of blue, yellow. So, like... Uh, I will indeed ready that spell. Okay. Uh, now, I guess I could roll... On that, and you, you could go for temporary control, because you're there. Yeah, if I want to, which if I do, oh, I get to sacrifice two dudes to advance one space. I mean, you can just... We can always just roll for it, and it's a may ability, not a must. Sure, let's see if I get yeah. control of it. You roll it. a die every turn on your... I got a tentacle. Unless you don't have to. Does that... No, that it's, the, it's the Cthulhu head. Only on the six. Got yep. it. Cool. Uh, yeah, so I'm fine. Uh, alright, so now I move on to the conclude, which is if I want to ready a spell, and so it's I have access to white and green. Um. And red. And red, yeah. Right. True. Right. Uh, I actually do, in fact, have a white and green. We're casting magics. We're casting we're so many ready, magics. Readying them. Right, I should read the one I can cast. It's a yellow <laughs> spell. So uh, I've got a red and a, a, a yellow uh, all sorted out. Uh, now I get to draw, I've got two cards, well actually I've got one card in hand because this is a gate card, it doesn't count towards my maximum, so I'm going to draw two cards. And I uh, I don't have any investigators up in my lodge, so that is the end of my turn. Go ahead, Matt. Oh, all you're supposed right. to you're supposed to draw a spell card at the end of the turn, right? Yes. Okay. I don't think I did that on my I turn. believe you. There you I go. I think I did. Okay. Draw, I drew uh, three you... when I got to the library, but then yeah. I didn't draw one at the end. Right. Uh, yeah. yeah, right, because you always draw one or up to up three. Up to three, yeah, I had four in my hand. Does yeah, Ben yeah. need to ready that spell or does he get it for free? I get it for free, that's my ability. Yeah. Hot. Yep. I unexhaust, and now I shall oh, move. Yeah, did you cast a second spell and paid cost? Or you you got one by... Right, sorry, so but, this so goes that away. Go away. Yep. And then my also get replaced? Is that what we forgot? Or no, no, not get they don't get replaced. Cool. Yeah. Now I shall We're move. We're doing it. Yep. <laughs> I'm going to move to the library. Okay. Check. We do not have three. Nope. Now we have Now three. if anybody goes to the library. Exciting. A lot of cult stuff's going on over there. So now I draw three, I believe? Yes. Yes. Draw ready, three activated cards the ability. for the library. And then you may ready an additional spell. Mm -hmm. All right. What spells do I have? So it's like you can spend you have this white card twice. Yeah. To ready spells. If and you you've to. got access to red, too, from the library. Yes. Oh. You have a red uh, and a white. I should roll for control. 
Sure. I think you're supposed to do that after, but maybe after? it doesn't matter. Well, you, you do it after... Well, you've done the first ability, which is okay. draw, draw three decks. cards, and it's just noted that you can ready an extra yeah. spell. Okay, okay. Now you it's the control way. Okay. Yeah. 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 Tentacles. You do not with the tentacles. Tentacles. I will ready a spell. Uh, for red white. Okay. You can You've see. got a readied spell. Excellent. And now I have an extra green. I love it. Uh, hmm. Can't use it for anything yeah. though. There is no yeah. There's no max hand size as much as three is just the least hand size at yeah. the end of your turn. Uh, and the gate cards don't count towards your the, the, the minimum three things. They do not, no. So if you have... So I had one have, card and a gate card. So yeah, I one card two. and a gate card, you draw two, yeah. So that is the end of that card there. Okay. All right, just doing the one green spell. Yeah. And that's my turn. Okay. Cool. Um, all right, sorry, I have, I have to decide where I'm moving real quick here. No worries. I'm going to actually put my spells here just to clarify for chat a little bit what's in an astral column. Okay, I have this red thing. Where is the, is there any blue mana available? There is in this gathering spot. Okay, yeah. so I have a green thing I could throw down. I do. Yeah, they didn't really say. I guess it's ast They keep saying astral symbols. We're probably just going to say mana. <laughs> no, it's. I want to learn the terminology. Yeah. Correct me. I'm. I'm into it. I like. I like this game so far, and it doesn't deserve to have all my magic baggage. <laughs> <laughs> magic baggage is a very apt term. Yeah. yeah. Exactly. Like everyone else who's met me, they don't yeah. deserve this. I keep refer I keep thinking of uh, prepare as upkeep. Yeah, that's fair. <laughs> I mean, honestly, unexhaust is egregious. Yeah. But otherwise, great job, yeah. everyone who made this game. Great job. Just give me refresh. Okay, I'm paying a green here. I'm yep. putting a green down to move the Cthulhu over to the green area. Into the gathering, yeah. The gathering. We've done it. We check. There are not three investigators. Now we grab a lodge boy and... Uh, An investigate lady. Yeah, a where in the world is Carmen San Diego? Oh, did you, you draw at the end of your turn, Matt? Oh yeah. Did you oh, get I one did more not. Card? There you go. Sorry. We're always gonna forget to do that. Yeah. Okay, that's our that's our tradition. Okay, now we, um, uh, yeah, we did the check already. Roll a die for temporary control. Yeah. And then activate. Temporary control die. Didn't get there. That's fine. Mm -hmm. Okay. Now we want to do the thing, which is move some more boys in there. Gain three cult. Oh, they're from the. From sorry, the they're void. from the, the abyss, aren't they? Yeah. Okay, cool. So, grab three buddies, and then to your lodge. You may move one from the gathering to any location. I like it. Yeah. Well, I should probably be smart about where I'm going to go. I have a blue in my mm -hmm. hand. Maybe I'll end up going to the blue spot. Who knows? Okay. And then I can cast a spell, and then I'm done. Right. As per normal, uh, as is tradition. Mm -hmm. All right, so I came here partly to use you can keep your the blue and green mana. I have a blue and a yellow. Oh, dang. But I have this yellow here on my table, so I can cast a blue Yeah. Yellow. So now I have a red spell readied. Okay. And I'm spent. So I cast a spell here. I did use this. So this gets discarded. Yes, it does. I draw one card. I have three cards in hand. Yeah. I remembered. And there we go. That's the turn. See? We're get, yeah, we're getting it. Go this ahead. is great. Okay. The dynamic so. of the uh, of the spells that you're ready also being used to cast more spells is quite interesting. Yeah, because like, I'm like, some of these are really good, but right. also, like, I like having mana. <laughs> I haven't even been reading my spells, because, like, most of them cost three of the same color, so I'm like, I don't even know what... The, the goal is to get to be yeah. able to cast spells right now. You don't need the cost once you've cast it. Yeah, I know. I know. Yeah. All right. Uh, here's what we're gonna do. I'm a I'm a spend a blue, and uh, I'm gonna move on over to the museum. Oh. Doing the check. There's uh, not uh, too many investigators here, so my homies are coming on up. Your homies. Uh, and so I get to choose which of these artifacts I would like. Uh, oh right, I can roll right first. I can roll the die for temporary control. Nope, tentacle. All right. Tentacles. So, which of these two do I want, or do I want to go with what's in the mystery box? I kind of want the shroud, actually. The shroud seems pretty cool. The lamp is destroyed. Is that how it goes? Yeah, you choose one, and the other one gets destroyed. Oh, and well, goodbye, lamp. See you later, so, lamp. So you've got the dust of Yoggoth, which is you can 
uh, destroy it to discard a spell from your hand to cancel any spell being cast. The spell is discarded without effect. You got a counter spell. That's right. Wow. Or the Elder Mask, which is you can exhaust it during your turn to place one additional uh, uh, investigator on your location. Uh, or okay. you can uh, get rid of it to you do not take a investigator from a location this turn. Mm. Mm. Interesting. Sounds like there's a lot of play to that one. Yeah. I just want to double check and make sure that uh, it the if the item comes into my ha uh, into my area uh, unexhausted. <laughs> That's the one thing I got to I feel like probably. Probably like I can use it right away. That's what I'm hoping for. But if not, I mean, I understand. I don't remember reading anything about it anything coming in. Exhausted. Place it face up into your area. Yeah, it mm -hmm. doesn't say anything different, so All right. I got the, I put this silk shroud on right away. Mm -hmm. So what is the silk shroud? So the shroud is, I can exhaust it to move one uh, investigator being placed on my lodge to somewhere else instead. I can wild, I can ricochet it to, to another nice. area. But or, it, it's only, it's like a counter though. It's not a guy who's already on your lodge. It's, no, yeah, it's, it's yeah. a very specific instance of if something's going to be placed, in, uh, investigators going to be placed into my lodge, I can send it somewhere else instead. But you can do that every turn. So yes. every time you Or I can get it, rid of yeah. it. To just uh, take two uh, friends from my lodge uh, out. Okay. So, all right. So that was the uh, the activate of the location. So now it's conclude. I can ready a spell if I would like. And what mana do I have access to? Or astral signs do I have access to? I got a blue and a yellow. And a yellow and a red. <sighs> well, dip. That's so much. How can you not cast anything? You only have one more slot, though. So. There's a very specific color that I do not have access to. Mm. Mm. Purple. Mm -hmm. It's always the way, isn't it? Yeah. Uh, so I will not ready a spell. Are you going to cast a spell? No, you know what? I'll just I'll leave it. Okay. Um, spells can be cast at any time, by yeah, the way. Yeah. Or, or dependent on the card Red, will have readied timing. spells. Yeah, yeah, exactly. The card will have timing restrictions on yeah. it. So I uh, I'll draw. I've got two cards, so I'm gonna draw one. Okay. Up to three, and uh, my I don't have five friends to raid. So Matt, it's your turn, friend. All right. What shall I do today? I am not going to unexhaust because I'm not exhausted. How lucky. <laughs> Every morning right. I have to unexhaust. <laughs> and it's always at like 7 or 6 Yeah, or yeah. I've been waking up at like... I, so my goal is to start waking up at 8.30. Okay. That's when I want to wake up. Yeah. I'm in a hard time a breaking time. 9. You know, 9 is very respectable, sir. Yeah. There's, and there, there's those, those uh, times where you've been hit by uh, some sort of frost breath effect. Yeah. Where you just you can't unexhaust that turn. Yeah, yeah. for sure. Yeah. I'm gonna roll for control. Where'd you end up going? We all Matt? have those days. Ah, Matt the went ceremony. to the ceremony. Sometimes you can't even explain it. Cthulhu had. Ooh, you do Ooh, have did control. It. Doing I'm temporary it. Temporary control. All right, so let's go through your things. First off, I gain a gate card. Yeah, and you get Fun. to do your special ability. Masks. I destroy one uh, cultist from each other cult's lodge. See Ouch. Ya. Then I place an investigator on each other cult. Hey, line. Matt, you sneaky I'm little. I'm send that investigator towards you. Oh, instead. wow. Dirty. Instantaneous effect. Wow. No, you get it. Rude. <laughs> I mean, you were about to do it to me. It turns yeah. out that cultist of Yog Sothoth was an investigator investigating yeah. a different cult. And I may sacrifice two cultists from the ceremony to advance one space on my summon track. Seems right. Which I shall do. Yeah. All right. Matt is in the lead with winning. One. one point. Doing it. We've gotten somewhere. Okay. Yep. Uh, that was exciting. Good job rolling that octopus face. Yeah. yeah. And now I shall uh, ready a spell, I believe, if I can. So you got access to white, red, and green currently. White, red, and green. I am going to... Ready a green, green white. white. Sure. Okay. So that's there. Now I have yellow. And I guess that gets discarded. That gets discarded. Uh, and that is my conclusion. I do not have five or more investigators in my lodge. So make sure you do your draw. And draw, draw back up to three or draw one. Okay. Draw one. All right. I would like to send mm -hmm. our friend the fate token to the yellow land of. Uh oh! Yes, everyone gets to party when we go to the yellow place. Yeah, 
Uh, we should just keep one of the dice over here, maybe. I don't yeah, know. Yeah. yeah, I think that makes the most sense. Okay. Uh, so you, first off, got a check. Okay, first check, yeah. only one investigator. So we put one of each in and there. And one of mine in there. And then roll for temporary control yep. next. Rolling. Failed. Okay. And then we do the things. So at this location, we must move some things around. Place two uh, raid boys, uh, Carmen San Diego's, from your lodge or supply to any other lodges. Then initiate a raid on all other lodges. How about we give... So you only have one to give. No, or the from supply. Your lodge. Or, the, okay. or the supply. Or the supply. Yep, so sure. you take, take one, one from there and then one from the Okay, supply. great. Well... I wanted to give them both to Matt, but the shroud is tapped, so I feel like I have to give one to Ben for the purpose of gaming. Sure. And so I'll give you each a one. Each, love each of you have an investigator. And yep. now, and then they raid. That's okay. the next thing that happens. So, yeah, so I guess we'll do mine. Okay. You roll one. Oh, so You're I got gonna... a Cthulhu head, which means it just dies. It just dies. Fun. And... It goes away. Yes. Yeah. That investigator shouldn't have taken and on all Matt those crazy two. Notes. Matt, oh, you get one goes away, one stays, and you get an elder sign. I have one elder sign. Okay, so it always starts off the farthest away from you. Yes. yes. Okay. It goes backwards. Mm -hmm. Okay. The guy, the guy that was on Ben, was like, "I'm going in." They're like, "No, wait for backup." It's like, "No, <laughs> no. I'm doing it." <laughs> <laughs> okay. I would then like to ready a spell. Sure. So you've got access. I have to... I, two yellow and well, three yellow and a red, really. But I have one that costs two yellow. Dang. Oh, So okay. I will ready this green spell. You are full of spells now. Oh, you can only have three? You, max three. Max okay. three. It's time to start popping some of these spells off. Yeah. So doing some magic. You can still ready a spell, but then you have to cast Discard some another here. spell in response. Yes. Yeah. yeah. You either have to cast that spell immediately or cast one of your other spells. Yeah. Got it. Okay, well, maybe I'll cast a spell. All this right. It's the I actually all. get to... Unexhaust. Oh my god. Dun, 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 Unexhausting. Dun. Unexhaust step complete. Con um, nice all right. Coffee consumed. Yeah. yeah. You put on your hat and it, it just feels right. You know? <laughs> uh, okay. I am going to. God, what am I going to do here? Something good. We're doing good things, right? That's what this game is about? Yes. We only do good things here at the Cult of Huster. Uh, I'm going to... Welcome to the culture. Go culture to the Hustler. other worlds. How may I take your order? <laughs> yeah, yeah, I guess, that does I guess so. Alright, because you have a... I have a gate. You got it. Uh, doing the check. There's not a lot of investigators over here Checking. in the other worlds. <laughs> yeah. So I'm going to put a friend of each in there. Okay. Uh, I'm going to roll for temporary control. At the beginning of the game, there was one, though, so that's... Uh, right, it's the Cthulhu head, not the tentacle. So, didn't get there, unfortunately. Okay. Uh, now we're going to resolve that location's ability, which is I get to roll one dice for each uh, cultist I have, and for each tentacle or Cthulhu head, I can sacrifice a, uh, a cultist to advance my track for each one sacrificed. Cool. I didn't get the thing, so I don't get to do the double, but... Get there? I can sacrifice one. Awesome. I will do that. I'll Tied for first. Sacrifice one, uh, and uh, yeah, move move up one. Yog Sothoth is coming. He's, He's on coming. his way. It's yeah. yeah, it's it's happening. Yeah. Right. You sacrifice a guy from your lodge from that or, location, from, or right? from the location. Yeah, from the location. Yeah. yeah. First, we have to get. Yeah. We have to get the cultists to the other worlds. Then we can eat them. Yeah, yeah. that's kind. Of, it's kind of tough. You need to like keep putting more and more in. Um, okay. So now I can make a, make spells happen, I guess. I've got access to any mana, or any astral sign. Green, red, and yellow. Mm. Hmm. I guess I'm going to go ahead and... There's going to be some raids going down pretty soon. There's a lot of investigators on this. Yeah, yeah, I think that's sort of how it goes. It's like it starts hitting these critical masses. Uh, all right, I'm going to activate, uh, yeah, this uh, this one, which is a red and a white. I've got access to red and the, the random one from white. Okay. So I've got another yellow spell there. This is going to go away. 
Uh, and uh, I get to, yeah, draw a card. I don't got five friends, so it's Matt's turn. All right. I am going to... Uh, not unexhaust, because I have nothing to do with it. I'm going to double up Ooh. on white to move to the museum. Okay. okay. Check. Yeah. We're fine. Yeah. We're fine. Now put more Now people. it's not going to be fine. That's right. And roll for control, I guess? Yeah, yeah seems good. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, sure. Nah. No, Dude, not this time. All right, in the museum, I may take one face-up artifact or the top of the artifact. Would you, like, counterspell or... Uh, whatever this is. Yeah. yeah. You move, can move make more investigators around. come yeah, around. make more investigators party. If I take the top one, do these get refreshed? I believe so with the way that you were doing it. Um, Seems like you could go either way. Yeah, let's take a look. So, oh, at, the, ourselves. Yeah, at the museum, uh, all remaining face-up artifact cards are discarded and moved to the bottom of the artifact deck and two are revealed. Yep. So, I'm going to take the top one here. All right. All right. What is it? A shining trapohe mm. trapezohedron. You may hold up to two gate cards. Oh, nice. Whenever another cult moves... Sorry, I can tap whenever another cult moves to the ceremony and draw a gate card. Whoa, that seems pretty good. That so anytime we go good. to the ceremony, you can tap it and you just get a gate card. Yeah. That seems pretty good. You can hold Free two passage. gate cards. Yeah. I will also ready a spell. Uh, one for a white and a blue and a green, which I have a mixture of here. Mm -hmm. Behold my mixture. That will go down. I believe... So you guys I... are all, all full up with spells now. Yeah. Pretty much. Ex hmm. Thinking, do I want to use something? You know what? While you're thinking about it, Matt, I'm gonna use Gosh, the spell on you. Which is which is cursed. cursed? Choose a cult. They become cursed. What the hecky? I'm choosing Matt. Cursed. Matt, I'm cursing you. Is it left or right that gets the curse? Right. Right. So you get. One? I well, no. So you get cursed. I read your curse. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. So here you go. It's not he, he Think about curses and curses will come into your life. Yeah. yeah. Whoop. All right, let's see here. Okay. Whoa, that's messed up. All right, Matt. Whatever it is, it's messed up. Yeah, you're cursed, bud. Well, I'm going to activate a spell. Uh-oh. Things are happening. I guess we shots were fired. Yeah. It begins yeah. now. Magic is afoot. Corruption. Uh oh. I shall sacrifice okay. two cultists from my lodge. See ya. Or become cursed, but I'm not going to become cursed again. Then I may advance one on the summon track or destroy two elder signs from my lodge. I'm going to advance one to get to two. All right. Air horn emoji. Air horn emoji. Gnarl Athathep gets closer. Gnarl. Right. Okay. So uh, that is my turn. Did you draw back up the three? Draw back. Did you ready a spell at this location? I did. I ready a spell. Okay. Should we discard the spell cards on the location oh, yes. then? Okay. Perfect. Good catch, Nelly. No problem. All right. Okay, on my turn, mm -hmm. I wish to use a magic as well. I have a magical user of magic. Okay. Find gate. At the start of your turn, draw one gate card. Ooh. During the move phase of your turn, you must use this gate card for movement. Where are you going? I want to go to the place where you have to have a gate to go there. Ah, the other worlds. Yes, let's check. Are there too many investigators out in yeah. space? <sighs> no, no, but there certainly are now. <laughs> there will be, though. Yeah. I will now roll for temporary control of the Shadow Realms. I am not good at this. Nope. Haster does not take temporary control of places. <laughs> okay, let's do the ability. That's where I sacrifice some cultists, maybe. Oh, it involves rolling dice, so I'm going to fail at it. Excellent. Oh, I didn't. Hooray. I got one. I got two. There you go. They're hey! both dead. And you moved up to two. Rolling dice when it counts. Dang. Catching up. Should we refresh the <laughs> things here? 
Oh, yes. Sorry. <laughs> oh, yeah, Good call. Do I wasn't going to go to the museum this yeah. turn. We've got the silver key, which you can mm -hmm. tap it to move one cultist from any one location to any other location where you have less, uh, you have one or less uh, things. So you, you, if there's nothing in a spot, like for example, what Nelly just did, right. you can sneak people into the other worlds, it looks like. Cool. Or you can discard it to move the fate piece to any other location. Cool. Okay. So it's, so it's, uh, it's two, a movement. Yeah, it's kind of like a warp in it's a way. It's two yeah. seven points for you, Nelson? Yeah, I, I moved it up. Yep, two seven points for me. That's right. Uh, we found the two. Necronomicon. Oh, fun! Uh, when Flashing you gain this artifact, Raja you just <laughs> become cursed. Oh, um, wow. But you can tap it to add a, a wild card to for readying a spell, like a gate for readying a spell. Oh, okay. So you can always so have It's really one. good at magic, but um, you're cursed. Yeah, and you can discard it to move the fate piece to another location. We have both of these that can Neat. just kind of give you a free watt ride if you want. Hey. Okay. I, I I like that they're like they're in the uh, they're in the outer worlds. You roll the dice, you know, and the the cultists are like, "Yay, we rolled good! What happens?" <laughs> uh... <laughs> Come with me. <laughs> <laughs> You'll did, see. No, did nobody explain this to you? <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Jeez, we really need to. Uh... We really need to hire more management and training. Yeah. Like, HR needs to find out that the cultists in the other world didn't know what was happening when yeah. they were successful. Okay, so, sorry. <sighs> I did that thing. Mm -hmm. Now I need to ready a spell if possible. I do want to do that. Sorry, not that one. I have one that I can cast for, I think, a white and a yellow. Yes. I have a one that I can cast for a white and a yellow. Ah. It is a red kind of magic. Okay. And then I will draw back up to three, discard these other things that I used, and say, the turn is yours, Ben. All right. I unexhaust the shroud that I didn't actually have to exhaust. Okay. Um, man. Man. There are two places I can go mm. that don't involve me getting a bunch of investigators. Yep. So I can go, go to gather one? some homies, or I can go to the streets of Arkham. I have red. I have two reds <laughs> that I could use. If anyone's curious and has done some quick math, that means that if neither of my fellow players <laughs> pile up a bunch of investigators into their into their lodge, it means yeah. I have to. Yeah. So that's neat. Um. So I think I'm gonna spend uh, these two reds. To make it a green, I'm gonna to go to the gathering. We do not have too many investigators nope. until Ben went there. Mm. Now we do. Uh, Roll and, for control. Or? Yeah, sure. Why not? Rolling for control sounds like fun. I did not get there. Uh, so activating it, uh, I get to grab three homies from the from the the abyss. They come on in. Uh, and then I can move one of the homies at this location to any other location. Uh, you know what? I think I'm going to move one of these homies to the ceremony. Fun. You now have control of it. Well, mm -hmm. you'd only take control when you move the, the, the thing fate over. token yeah. there, right? Yeah. But yes, you will. It, yes. Yeah. Assuming he goes there on his turn at some point and no one's blown those guys up yet. Yeah. 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 So for those asking, how do you just normally get control? Exactly what just we just waiting. did there. Yeah. Yeah. Let's go someplace three times. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Uh, okay, so that's all of that. I have one card to my name. What act mana do I have access to here? Do you have any spells you Is want to activate? Green, blue, and then you have red, huh. yellow. I can actually do it. Sick. I'm going to do that. Blah. Yeah, no problem. Oh. It's, a, it's a green and a yellow. Yep. Green, yellow. That's going to go away there. Um, do you have anything else? That's, uh, that's it. I don't have draw too three. many homies, so I get to draw three cards. Mm -hmm. Whoop. What the heck do I want to do? You, can you either... want to go to the streets of Arkham or take a pile of investigators into your lodge. Yeah. But you're good at having a pile of investigators, right? Am I? <laughs> I think I'm the worst one so far. All right. I'm the most sealed. I believed in you. Uh, bad choice. I mean, that okay. won't put you over the five investigators, so that's something anyway. Yeah? Yeah. yeah. I am going to unexhaust my shining trapezidodron, uh, which was not exhausted. Mm -hmm. And I'm going to use my gate card. Okay. To go to other worlds. The worlds. It so. has three investigators, so I take them in. Hello. Welcome to the lodge of Nyarlathotep. Nyarlathotep. Yeah. And then I put my people down. Mm hmm. Roll for control. Get it. Well, 
Control those worlds. You did you. it. You have control. All right. I roll one die for each person I have at the other world. So yeah. that's two. And advance one space on my summon track for each uh, person's sacrifice this way. So you get one. One. You can do it. Uh, yeah, I advance one. That's dead. And then you get to roll again. How many? Well, I think it's just straight up it's just what one. you rolled, right? Oh, okay. So oh, for it's each, the same roll. If you roll. did roll one, you get to return. So, so you get him back. You got a free one. Yeah, I got a free one. Yeah. Does this guy this also guy go stays. because I rolled for him? No. 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 So but basically, you... for each, how how it works, right? Is you had two, so you yeah. rolled two dice now, and then so that just having them there is what gives you more dice. And yeah. then for each thing that you rolled, then you can sacrifice one of them to advance the thing. It doesn't. Happen until I roll the thing. Exactly. Say. Yeah. So it goes from here into here because, because you gotta. Time. Yeah. yeah exactly. exactly. And I go yeah. to three victory points. Yeah, but the question is, is it the same guy? <laughs> yeah, that's <laughs> yeah. right. That, that you got right. So Matt's got it's like a four investigators up in his guy. grill. Yeah. Mm -hmm. He's also I... got four summon points. Zalthia, so. the spells yeah. do mm -hmm. a bunch of different things. They just He's got three on. summon points. And it seems like, as far as I can tell so far, since I. I have I've seen two that do the same thing and are different colors. It doesn't seem entirely like connected to the the symbols on the back. I they ready a spell. Green, green, red. Yeah, red, and you definitely have green, access to that. Green. Perfect. Yeah. All right, these get discarded. Mm hmm. And that is my turn. Draw back up to three. Oh, draw back up. Just one. Or just one. Yeah. Cool. Okay. Well, I didn't entirely know what I was going to do on my turn. Sorry. I've been that's paying okay. attention to y'all's turns. That, yeah, I think that's way better. It's just so enthralling. Mm -hmm. it, yeah, it's very enthralling. I haven't been to the ceremony yet, and that looks like fun. Mm. I, although, Yeah, if you want to clear out those homies yeah, for me, exactly. I'd, I'd definitely be alright with that. Well, the only place I can go to not clear them out is the streets of Arkham, and I don't have a yellow, so I can't get there. I don't have two of the same ones, so... Yeah, I guess I should just figure out where I'm going based on... I can either go green, so blue, or feel, white. Yeah. I can go white. So that's, yeah. They all have a pile of dudes that are coming into my party. It's gonna mm -hmm. happen, my dude. Yes. What is the... Oh, are these things the symbol? Yeah, that's right. Okay, Those cool. Those are your seals. Seals. Yeah. Okay, great. Um... I'm the only one that has a seal so far. Okay, this is the one that's the most exciting. Great! Let's go... Can I cast this? Yellow, yellow... Blue. I don't have a blue mana. Can I cast one of these two? If I go to that place, you have man, to move so confusing. First. Well, he's I just, know. He's, he's yeah, I'm just trying to plan my turn. Move so you get the but you know what? That's not fun. Who cares? That's okay. I don't think I'm casting a spell this turn. I'll just pay a white. Mm -hmm. and go here because it's a fun place. Yeah, check. Show up. I tap. Okay, what's happening? I get a gate card. How come? All right, whenever he goes to the whenever, whenever anyone, anyone goes, goes to the ceremony. ceremony. Okay, that's fine. Anyone else? Yeah. Not Checking. There. there are three. They come into my house. Yeah. Ooh, and nice then house. we put more homies. A new one in. in there, and one of my ones from my lodge go in there. Now you've entered my realm. That's right. Uh, now it doesn't I... really matter when it's not my turn. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Now I try to have temporary control. I did it! Ooh! Fun! Okay, so now I get to you gain, a gate, gain a gate card. I'll take this gate card. And you activate your ability. Oh my god, this Can thing. I activate my ability. This is a big one. Okay. That. Yes. Yeah. So, starting from the ceremony and proceeding clockwise, I can roll a die for each location on the altar where I have a cultist. Which is most of them. So Everyone but the other worlds, yeah. I, I just cleared out the other worlds for victory, yeah. So, I'm gonna roll the dice a bunch. And then, what happens if I roll something? Um, It'll well. It's sorry. It's this right for each tentacle or Cthulhu. Place a cultist from my lodge in that location and move an investigator from there to any other location. Oh. Neat. I also want to use a spell. I am going to alter some fate. Either reroll up to three of my dice once, or one of your dice up three times. Maybe I could have played that after I roll the dice. I just think I'm going to do it. Okay. So You're I rolling think a lot of dice. I'm right. going to roll. What is it? One, two, three, four. Five, I'm going to roll five dice. Starting from here. So I'm going to re-roll three of them. I'm going to use three re-rolls. Well, I guess you're, supposed to, you're supposed to do it for like each location, I think, right? Because uh, it matters in which order. location. Yeah. Each okay, location okay. in order. Each location so it's like, order. so first, we're doing the ceremony, so you roll okay, two, so, right? Okay, so sorry. I roll, so I roll two. Is it two? Is it two, or is it just one dice for each location? Sorry. I thought it was one for each. It, it says... Oh, yeah, it's it's here. Sorry, I keep yeah. looking over here. Sorry, yeah. sorry, sorry. <laughs> for, okay, for each... Yeah, you may roll one dice for each location on the altar. Yeah. No, it's just one dice. Ah, okay. I'm only rolling one die. So right. for each location, I'm rolling one die if I have any number of cultists there. Okay. I didn't get one. All right. So, the streets of Arkham. 
Okay. You can, or he can. Or I can it. reroll. So I'm trying to figure out how to use this magic card or spell card correctly. So what does it say? So it says either reroll up to three of my dice once, or one of my dice up to three times. So it sounds like I probably just get one, one shot to roll the dice three more times. Yeah. And then like. get the Cthulhu head. And when I do the Cthulhu head, or the tentacle, yeah, I move. I place. Occultist from my lodge in that location, and I move an investigator from there to any other location. Yeah. So you can choose to use that. I don't want to use it here. I don't use okay. It here. All right. So now we're moving to the streets of Arkham. I got a you Cthulhu got head here. Okay. So, so I get a lodge buddy, and I put this buddy somewhere that. I thought you moved one that Sorry. you had there. Oh, my bad. Okay. From my lodge on that oh, location. Oh, from, yeah. my, oh, from my yeah, lodge he was doing on that location. And move yeah. yep. from there to an. Oh, I was doing right. I grab this guy. Damn, Haster, your ability is so difficult. Yeah, yeah, it's so many words. I screwed it up so many times already. Okay, great. I've got to put this anywhere. So I guess I'm just supposed to pile them into somewhere that I don't plan to go, but that I think you guys are going to want to. I'll just put one back in the ceremony. Yeah. <laughs> right here. Okay. I got one. Okay. It's a cool head. Investigator. Sure. Let's um, let's put it on the other worlds. Okay, this one. Got it. Wow. Okay. Wow. I I'm definitely casting the spell. He's popping <laughs> it off. Yeah. Let's put this one here. All right. Nothing I don't have one here. So it's museum. This one. This is my last one. So I think I'm probably gonna get it. Okay. Nope. I'm gonna cast it. I'm gonna reroll three more times if necessary. First reroll. I got it. Okay. Oh, wow. So I get my last buddy from my lodge goes in here, mm -hmm. and then one of these guys goes somewhere else. Probably here. Yeah. Okay. Excellent. Uh, that I, was fun. So now Nelson has control of like three places. Well, when I go there, yeah, yeah. I have a lot of guys out on the table because that's yeah. what my ability does. I don't have anything, any boys in my lodge anymore. Uh, it is worth noting that, yeah, when you have no people in your lodge, yeah. Uh, when you go to a place, uh, you have to take them from uh, the other places or the abyss. Or? Uh, yeah. So if you have nobody in your lodge, uh, when you go to a place, you take right. a guy from the or you take two guys from the abyss. One goes into your lodge. One goes on to the place, and you get a seal. Yeah. Oh. So for your for your insolence. Maybe I'll start losing real fast here. That's great. Okay, back to my turn. We are on the ceremony. Now, the control ability is sacrifice two cultists from the ceremony to advance one space on your summit track. Yeah. You so, don't have to do it if you don't want to. Got it. He's doing it. All right. They're both dead. Three points. Three points indeed. I don't think I'm casting a spell. Uh, I have access to yellow, white, yellow, green. Oh, I can cast this one. I guess what I might is as well. This? this is a gate card that I gained through... Something going, there. going to the ceremony. Right, yes, yeah. yeah. So I get to keep this. Yeah, right? that's in your hand. Oh, okay. It's just yeah. in my hand, but it doesn't count towards my hand size, yeah. right? Okay, I have a yellow white. Yellow white. So I will put this here, and then we'll get rid of this. I will draw back up to three regular spell cards. That's two, and the turn is back. All right. Whew, that was a lot of stuff. Yeah, so much hey, stuff boy. happening. Damn. Yeah, it was a long turn. Thanks for waiting. All right. Uh, it's all hats. Who knows if I made any of those decisions correctly? I'm sure you did. Yeah. They seem correct. All right, I unexhaust. I didn't have to exhaust, but I did. Uh, all right, guess what? I'm going to the streets of Arkham. Oh. When we do a check. You're safe. We're safe. So one there, and another one of my homies. Are you going to uh, roll for... Sure. I know, uh, I know there's another cult here, but uh, if they could uh, give me the keys for a moment, that'd be pretty Maybe. cool. Maybe. Uh, you know, we'll see. Uh, Can't do it today for you, boss. Uh, that's Sorry. all right. I understand, man. Next time. Next time. Okay. Um, so... Maybe we'll put on a tie. All right. Yeah. yeah that makes sense. Yeah. I don't have any homies in my lodge, so I'm going to put you have four, one... Right? Oh, oh, any... Uh, any uh, uh, any investigators. Homies. Sure. Um, Alhazred's Vengeance. Oh boy. Okay. Reveal when another cult takes an action that places at least one investigator on my lodge, that cult becomes cursed. No! Oof. So, is it me who curses you? Yeah. You ready? You watch the curse. I yeah. watch, I hold the curse, You don't right? tell him until it activates. Well, I'm cursed. These are my, these are my spells I have. Yeah. So okay. you just keep hold of that and keep track. If the situation is already the case, though, it'll just happen immediately. Yeah. yeah. Reading. Not out loud. <laughs> I don't know what a word means. Uh, what area is the reserve? 
Over there. Uh, oh, this, uh, this is the... The bank? Uh, in, if you're talking Can about, if you're talking yeah. about uh, guys, then it's the middle area. It would be the reserve. It's not talking about guys. Do you think that's just popping off now? Okay, so yeah. Oh, I see. Okay, so it's when the cursed cult has two or more spells in their reserve, which is oh, like I have your three. available mana. You have three. Most of us have been getting two or three. Yeah. As you recite the incantation, your voice falters and the magic fails. Discard all spells in your reserve. No or, way! Or gain two seals. Oh, your, call. your call. Your so call. So this one, did. this one went off right away. All right. No, I'm taking two. Two seals onto the track for Ben. Yeah. Oof. Ow. All right. Now okay. I'm not the most sealed one. Curses aren't messing around. All right, oh, so that was molly. that was just you resolving the Streets of Arkham ability. Yeah. But now there's also a raid, right? So, yes. Uh, was there anything else that was happening? Um, Any other things? The people were placed. So you actually, you put an investigator on each of them, right? Yes. I have not. Okay. Nothing else. Matt, your curse pops off. Oh, boy. That's when you're about to be raided. Great, I love Fun. it. Uh, so, yeah, it's when the cursed cult is raided. So these cultists are actually a little bit more pissed than normal. Uh-oh. Cthulhu symbols uh, uh, count for uh, stars on this raid. So if I roll Oofa. basically a one or a six. Yes. Yeah, okay. That's Great. Dark. So, Matt, you get to roll five. I love this. I so, love this. So for now, so Cthulhu symbols... Okay. Cthulhu symbols are the exact same as the stars, so there's which only... means they get an elder sign and they stay. So there's only okay. two sides that are safe now. Yes. Wow, and Matt got three of them. <laughs> three but, safe. So yeah, so three go away, two stay and give you two elder signs. I now have three elder signs. Wow, that went a lot better for you than it could have. And uh, Nelly. I have four. You got four. Here we go. That worked out pretty well for you. I just, yeah, I guess. All right, curses, sometimes beatable. So I rolled a head, two tentacles, and a scar or something. So, so three of them die, again? and one stays and gives you an elder scar. Is that a scar or a scar? It's a scar. It stays, yeah. yeah. So, so this is a stay and hurt me. These are a takeoff. Yeah. And this is also a takeoff? Yeah. yeah. Take off, you hoser. Okay, I might cast a spell, too. Will you? Um, so only one of them is looking to stay and mess me up right now. Yeah. I will re-roll that dice three times with my Alter Fate. Right. Okay, so I've gotten rid of three of them. This is, am I, we're above board here? Okay. Re-roll number one. Still there, I think, on the, like, is yeah. this the, this is the it not... It leaves, but you get a... Oh, it leaves, but you get a thing. I'll re-roll it. Cthulhu head! All right, it just dies. Cool. Well, you, you guys survived that raid well. Thank you. Mm -hmm. Yes. Spending magical spells. Okay, this goes there. All right. Okay. Okay. Now, you didn't get control, right? I didn't get control, okay. yeah. So it's the, the back half of my turn, which okay. means I can ready a spell. I got access to anything. A yellow, yeah. you are a yellow, spells, a white. Though. Yeah, I'm full of spells over here, though. So what I will do is I'll use corruption, Okay. Oh. which I'm going to sacrifice two homies. Uh, to get rid Wait, of that two. Did, didn't you lose all your spells? No, instead he got a curse. Yeah. He had yeah. The oh right, yeah, yeah. Okay yeah. To get a... And oh, no, two I'm... seals, two seals. Not yeah, and what I'm seals. doing now oh, okay. is using corruption to sacrifice two homies uh, yeah, right, to two get seals. rid of these two elder seals. Clever, well, well strategized, my good man. Ho ho ho. Godly. Um, what do I got access to here? <laughs> Um, sure, I'll, uh, I'm gonna use this one. It's a red and a green. I got a green yep. from that and a red from my own spells here. Legit. Yeah. Popping that down, it's a blue mana that I got, or astral sign I got access to now. That wild card goes away. Probably put it here. Right. Ah, These yeah. are just a stack of wild yeah, cards, right? right. You just put it back on top. Yeah. Uh, and, uh, that is everything. I'm gonna draw back up to three from, uh, from one. Now, is your curse done? It yes. is, yes. That was Matt's it curse. Yeah, yeah, Matt's yeah. curse is gone. Right, yeah. okay. What do I want to do? Where do I want to go? Um, I have a couple options. Hmm. I am going to move to other worlds. There you Ooh, go. All right. 
Till you put it here. Well, you yeah. got it. You oh, put, yeah. put it in the astral track. Check. It's fine. It's, it's right fine, now. but no longer. Yeah. And now I'll roll, roll for control. Yeah. Roll for control. I do not get control. Now you uh, roll for your homies. Roll one die for each homie. And I have two. I get one. You get one. And I don't have control, so it goes there. Yep, yeah, and, and you advance one. I'm at four. Popping along. Points. Wow. Do I ready any spells? I will ready one spell that has two white as its components. Nice. And I will activate a spell right now. Sign of the Brotherhood. I choose one other cult uh -oh. to return one of their cultists from the abyss to their home. Okay. okay. I choose Ben. Okay. okay. So I get a home. Because you have none, sure. and that's when the trouble happens. Sure. And I also return three of mine from the abyss to my lodge. Oh. Party time. Ben, I like that we, Ben was like, okay. Yeah. yeah. yeah, 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 yeah. Cautiously <laughs> optimistic. To drop. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. Oh, and I didn't untap that. So oh, okay. untap it. All right. Um, and. Did you ready a spell, or do you want to? He did. Oh, you did? Okay. Yeah. I can only ready one. Okay. So Drop like a three. Did you get rid of the, the, the yeah. stuff for here? Your, pay your uh, thing. Yeah, I do that. Yeah. There we go. Perfect. Okay. I would like to pay... So you can use... A, a wild card is the same as two of the same, right? Yes. So do I want to use a wild card or do I want to use two of the same? I think I just want to use these two of the same. I don't All know right. if I use the wild card, maybe I could do... Yeah, I guess I could prepare that. Okay, fair enough. Can you use two of the same to go here, or does it have to be the purple card? You have to move away. I know. By the way. Sorry, I know. Yes, but you in can. another turn, you yeah. can. Okay, yep. then I'll just pay my gate card. So I'll leave this gate card here, mm -hmm. and I will go over to the gathering. Mm -hmm. I will first check to see if there's two main investigators. There are not, and then I will do what exactly? What happens to me when I have no, no colleges in my lodge? So you get two okay. coming on out of your thing. Okay, one goes to the lodge. Yeah, one goes here, and, and you then get one elder side. I have an elders. Sealed, right? It goes on the nine. Yeah. Cool. That was fun. Now, sorry, I'm supposed to roll for temporary control before this guy got here, right? Or I forget. No, that's the last part of the move phase. Okay, so, so I just have control. I don't have to do anything. I have uh, three. Control. Yes. Okay. So first, I return three uh, cultists from the abyss mm -hmm. to my lodge. I may move one of my cultists from the gathering to any location. Probably should put them over here. Mm -hmm. I believe with control you can move as many as you want. Oh, right. Yeah. And then with control I can move any number from my gathering to any other location. Well... Of course, that makes you lose control, but... Yeah, I mean, of course you it moved does. one, so you already lost control. Mm -hmm. So That's fine. Yeah, I'm okay with that. So you can move the others and not lose anything. Yeah. Well, it's like, do I want to... Yeah, let's just shove them all in there and just have control of this. That seems fun. Mm -hmm. Okay, so that's what happens there. And then I can ready a spell. It's mm -hmm. ba -ba -ba, the one that costs a green and a white from a green and a purple that's here. Mm -hmm. And then I'll ready that over here. It's a blue one. Makes sense. I will draw back up to three cards and pay this, and it's Ben's turn. Thank you. Um, before the on your end stop, yep. uh, I'm going to use the it. spell An Ancient Stirring. Uh oh. This Look was the, the one that I, I got at the beginning of the game from my gate. Look it at the top five red cards of the spell happen. deck and reveal a white or colorless spell. No, okay. and, right. but it does seem pretty cool. Uh, I just advance one on the summoning track. Sick. Uh, and then I can sacrifice one cultist at the current altar to just advance one more, which I'm going to do. What? Yeah. That's a good spell. It's That's not a nice bad. little bit of magic right there. Yeah. Ah, uh, yes. I see the... I am at three. Okay. Well done. Okay. Um, yeah. All right. Uh, my turn. I unexhaust my crap. Where do I want to go? What feels good? What's nah, calling nah, nah, to nah, 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 nah. Um, I know what's calling to me. I'm going to discard these two blue yep. ones. Oh. Just wa wop them uh, back. I'm going to walk gathering. over to the ceremony. Oh, go ahead, Matt. 
I I, I tap my uh, die thing mm -hmm. yeah. to get a gate card. Powerful artifacts. Checks the thing. We good. I am yeah. so in control of the ceremony. Yeah, you are. Do your thing. Uh, so, uh, I'm going to gain a gate card, if you don't mind grabbing me one, Matt. Gate. Thank you very much. Um, and uh, I activate my ability, which is I get to look at one place and uh, decide if I want it. So, uh, there's a surprising amount of gates actually kicking around, you yeah. should which know. I have nothing. Yeah, you should and know, I what know these those two. two are. So, really, the only ones are yeah. these two. Uh, I'm going to go with this one. All right. So is it you just get to ready it, or you have to use it? I can I can choose to either ready it or just discard it okay. for free. Um, yeah, I mean this one's probably fine. I'll keep it. That's green mana. <laughs> yeah. Who knew the brain elemental was good at magic. Mm-hmm. Um, and I control this area, so uh, I can sack two homies uh, to advance one space on my summon track if I'd like. Um, I. I I really like having control here. I mean, can you always talk to you? Isn't there another thing you do with control? Oh, it's it cast your spell, right? Yeah. 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 Um, like next time you go there, you're adding one anyway. No, the the second two homies, you have to, you have to. Have oh, control that's the control. That. Oh, right, right, right. Sorry, I just yeah. rolled. I rolled for temporary control last time. Yeah, right. you're actually that's a very good point, Matt. Uh, yeah, I'll uh, I'll get rid of these two homies and I will advance another one. So uh, I went from dead dead last to tied for first. Sick. It was popping off there. Big turn. Uh, now, I can choose to ready a spell. I've got all these spells here. Um, so I'm not going to do that. In fact, instead, I've got one card in the gate, so I'm going to draw two to go back up to three. Uh, Nelly, it's your turn. Or nope, Matt. Matt. <laughs> yeah. Sorry. I'd like it to be my turn again. I I'd do that. I think it's off. I play all the turns of this game. I'm having fun. <laughs> Where do I want to go? You can play, uh, apparently, one, one player, player, one player on this. Sure. It's pretty wild. Yeah, it's just you versus losing. Mm -hmm. <gasps> Red. The library. Welcome to the library. Oh, no. Too yeah, many, you get all those homies. Too many cops. Gonna be fun. There's a lot of cops over there. You're going to get raided at the end of your turn. So Unless I'm, you get rid of some. I'm matching power, so I have to roll to yes. get control. Yes. Yeah. There's no card here right now because you stole it. So I you did. Don't get yeah. Any, you don't get any bonus for casting, reading spell here. Nope. No dice. Okay. Well, one die. Um, <laughs> but it didn't roll what you wanted to see. Draw three spell cards. Okay. No big deal. You may ready one additional spell this turn. So, what do I want to ready, if anything? Uh, I mean, I'd like to ready other things, but I can't. So I won't. Yeah, I think that's how it's going to be. Okay. Uh, does a draw raid one. activate? Right. It's after your draw. Okay. So you get to draw. Draw one. Draw one. Raid time. Then you get to roll some dice. So you got five homies, which means you get to roll five dice. Well, at least they aren't super pissed off right now. Enjoy yourself. They're only mildly pissed off. It's time for dice. They weren't. They didn't do all that much damage when what they were fully pissed. What will be the fate of these nice. investigators? Uh, okay, mm. so you get three elder signs, and but they everybody who is there is leaving. Great. One, cool. two. I am cursed. Oof. Wow, they suddenly just kind of come out of nowhere and goof you. Yep. All right, uh, yeah, do you mind handing me a curse to curse Matt with? Exciting. So Matt has now officially gotten cursed from the Elder uh, signs, which means he cannot be cursed from it again. Okay. Uh, all right, Matt, let's see here. And then what's the other deal with the Elder signs? If the signs reach past the one, then you just lose? Yes, the game is okay. over. Okay. The game is over, and whoever has the highest summoning track of the other uh, of all us. Right, all right, all right. That's why, alive. okay, because at the museum, if you have control, you can blow up other people's Elder Signs, which yeah. like, might actually be advantageous to me to do, because I only have three victory points, and Matt has freaking six Elder Seals. you got to start leaving the bar a little sooner in the yeah. evening before you rack up so uh, many Elder all right. Seals, pal. All right, Matt, I know you're cursed. Have you considered drinking Elder Seals light? 
<laughs> I, I like the idea of all, all the like the other two cults getting like having intervention. Be like, yeah, be like, like come dude, on, yeah, yeah. It's like, you're ruining dude. It. You gotta yeah. keep a lower profile. <laughs> yeah, you like yeah, you show it's up. Like Nelson's got elder signs. I'm like yes, but Nelson has significantly yeah. less elder signs you're, than you. You're ruining it for the rest of us. Okay? Yeah. Yeah. Nobody Everything else notices my elder signs. Mm-hmm. So, yeah. yeah. Uh, I believe that's my turn. It is. You got raided. Okay. Did you pay the... Oh, there's nothing there already. Okay, great. I would like to go to the blue place we were speaking of earlier. So I Uh-oh. put this here. I I'll move you. that over there. You get three guys. I get three guys. Welcome to the Red Lodge. We are all sorts of fun and do fun things. But... One guy that was there. I have control. You are super in control of the museum. Yeah. So then I can either... I can either take one right now, or I can. Oh, so right off the bat, the you get first. to take one. Do I get to? Oh, okay. Do I have? Oh. So the way this the control part works is though it says you may discard and replace the artifact display. But what? So are if, you allowed to do that first? But yeah. what if? Oh, you're gonna magic me. I enthrall you. Okay. Oh, okay. And you want to do that before I do a thing? You I choose take, one take location that another yeah, call controls mm-hmm. and destroy two of their cultists from there. So bye. <laughs> you no longer control it. Okay, well, if you if magic is to be the game, then I can magic. That's Uh-oh, fine. Oh, magic fight! I, I'd like to somebody m- watch for the cops. That's right. I'd like to mind switch one of your buddies oh! uh, in any location with any other. So it's one of my cultists from any one location with any other cultists at a different location. So I might as well take. Who am I less interested in being at the library of the streets of Arkham? Let's get out of the streets of Arkham. You can have two friends over there. Mm. And now I will regain I control. Sound good? Yeah. Any more magic? Does anyone else doubt my magical supremacy? I believe in you. All right. All right. Um, okay, so yes, before taking the basic action, you may discard the two face of artifacts and draw two new artifacts from the dis- uh, from the artifact deck. Okay. So then you may do the sacrifice. Because it seems like the purpose of destroying the artifacts is to like gain new options. Yes. So, you should probably want to do it before you choose your artifact that you're taking, rather than after. Yeah. Although, I might just want to take this key. This key seems pretty sweet. The key is... What does the key do? Tap to move one cultist from any one location to any other location where I have one cultist or less. Mm-hmm. And it doesn't say your cultists. So any place where I have one or less person, I can just move y'all's cultists there. And then I can sacrifice it to move the fate piece. You, know, like you can use it for a free move. Hmm. So I could grab this. The Necronomicon seems a little sketchy. I don't know. You get How a curse. How bad can a curse be? You tap to add. I, I feel like sketchy is probably like the nicest thing people have said about the Cryptonomicon. Yeah. <laughs> the Necronomicon. <laughs> yeah, exactly. <laughs> um, you know what? Sure. Why don't I? I'm in control. I'll use the control thing. So I'll put these two on the bottom. All right. And then reveal two new ones. What do we got here? The Amulet of Nefren Ka. Tap, so, change one. Oh, dice rolls. Okay. Oh, so you change can change. The scratches to tentacles. Oh. Or the Jade Statue. Scratch. If you are at the other worlds, re roll up to two of your dice. Okay, so I can kind of help you in the game. Hmm. Uh, we're in the middle of the, the place here. Sure. Let's grab this this beetle thing. Cool. Jade the other one. Statue is Gross. destroyed. Goes to the bottom. And All right. Two more. And now. There is a ceremonial dagger. You can destroy it to return to the supply up to five investigators from your lodge, and then you become cursed. Yeesh. Neat. Okay. Um, that might be worth. And the runic chalk, uh, when it is in play, it increases your spell reserve by one. So you can have four. Okay. And you can get rid of it to ready a spell for free. Cool. It's pretty cool. That's pretty cool. Uh, what else do I do now? I've done the activity for this location. Oh, no. I can also destroy... Uh, I can sacrifice up to three cultists from the museum, and then I get to get rid of an Elder Seal. So I want to yeah. do that. I have one Elder Seal, I will put it away. Oh, my going to sacrifice one of my guys to get rid of one mask, too. No, not yet. You can be a... You can take care of yourself, I'm sure. It's one per, or three? Yeah, it's one, up to three, okay. and then destroy one per. Uh, and then I will ready a spell, if able. I have a gr- blue? A blue, got a, wild, and a wild, blue and a wild. And two green, blue, wild, green, green. Can't do it. Just gonna draw a card and pass the card. Okay. Um, I untap my shroud. So, what do I wanna do? Um, you wanna have a good time. I do. I yeah. Um, hmm. Everybody. Love you, love you. Uh, 
Yeah. <laughs> Does uh, anyone know? Yeah, I'm playing Oscar. <laughs> hmm. King of Yellow Jacket comics. Love it. I, I wish. More Let's like see. Looking at your spells? Yeah. We're going to take a quick... How um, best I can use them. What's it called? A ASMR break. <laughs> Just... ASMR? Oh my god. I would actually enjoy that a lot. Uh... <laughs> Some of these abilities, hmm. Um. This game's simple until you have to make a decision. Mm -hmm. Pretty much. <laughs> yeah, really. <laughs> uh, okay, I'm gonna use a yellow. I'm gonna go to the streets of Arkham. Ooh. Welcome. Yeah. Um, oh, I didn't get rid of my cards. But I didn't ready a spell. Does that matter? You did, yeah, yeah. It's so only stay if you there a spell. If you don't ready a spell, got yeah. it. Okay. Uh, so, do and check. There isn't uh, too many homies there. I also now control the streets of Arkham. Mm, um, so, let's uh, let's do some abilities, shall we? So, um, what is the control? After you raid, I can sacrifice one from the streets of Arkham to put another homie on everyone. Wow. Uh, okay, so I don't have any homies here, so I'm actually... So, so, sorry, could we differentiate between... Uh, homies that are cultists and homies that are uh, investigators. What about if they're all my homies, Paul? <laughs> no, the investigators are cops, you guys. Yeah. One is homies with an IE, the other is homies with a Y. Yeah. That that, that doesn't help <laughs> I just for agree. the reading out front. And, and yeah. one of them is Homer from The Simpsons. Yeah. I'm going to put both of them on Matt. Wow, rude. You know, that will make me seal faster, right? Yeah. If you lose, and then I just get higher than Nelson, I win. You're already higher than me. Yeah. Aren't you? I'm yeah. on three. He's so I'm on high four. Above yeah. You. I'm so lovely. He doesn't have to win. He just has to go oh, faster. Oh, if, you're, than if you. you're tied with the person who seals out, do you win? Like if he, if Matt got four more seals right now, mm -hmm. do you win? Because you're both on four. I am. He's out of, out the, of the, game. the game. Oh, cool. So you'd yeah, win. I would win. So it's great. So you just want to raid, just raid him as hard as possible. Yeah. yeah. Uh, okay. Well, you guys both get raided. Okay. Uh, Nelson, you got has three. Nothing. Oh no, wait, he has three. I have three. Let's do this. I got two tentacles and a star. So, so... you get three seals and one person stays. Mm -hmm. Unless oh, no, he magic. Is it one steal? One, yeah, one seal one. and one stays. Sorry. Okay. Um. And you have. Yeah, sounds good. What's your re-rolly thing do? Oh right. I can change, I can tap to change, not this one, not the star. Yeah. I have to change wound to tentacle. Yeah, it has to, it's only the, it's yeah. only the, yeah. It doesn't work on this one specifically. So, this one always gets me, because that's two, why, so. Yeah, so two die and you get one steal and one stays. Cool, I accept. Matt, you got two dice. Love it. Uh, I get sealed once, but yeah, everyone one, goes. Yeah. I am up to... Wait, can I change that to a tentacle so you don't have a seal? Because you rolled... It was a scratch that sealed that got you the thing. I not think... a star, right? Yeah. Does it say okay? you? Or... No, it just says change one No, yeah, he can. Tentacle. He can save Matt. Okay. I will Thank keep you? that seal from getting on you. Yeah, it's okay. I didn't want to use my cultist, but I'll use my artifact. That's okay. Huh. All right. I mean, I'm... It makes sense. Strategically, I don't win if Matt dies right now. Yes. Yeah. So... It makes sense. So we're teaming up against Ben, then. This turn... Anyway. I, I I do like in the uh, actually uh, in oh, you kind of in, actually in response I'm gonna use transmogrify change one roll die to any new face uh, I'm gonna change that to a star or the a star sign brutal okay so Matt actually keeps it it stays there and gets the star sign all right I'm not sure what else I can do about that <laughs> it's happening right. I could well yeah that's fine whatever all right uh, and then the control ability is I can sack a, a one of I can sack a good homie. Because <laughs> they're good. Damn good. The cultists uh, are the good guys. Yeah. Uh, to put another um, uh, investigator on every other lodge. And I'm going to do that. So I'm going to sack this friend. Uh, and Ship. each of you... I take. Thank you. It's uh, some investigators. Welcome. Uh, all right. Now I can ready a spell since I've got two here. So what do I have? I have access to... Is that yellow, purple? Yellow, so yellow, wild. wild. Yellow. Yellow, anything, green, yellow. Yeah, yellow, yellow, green, anything. Um, yellow, yellow, green. Mm -hmm. Yellow, yellow, green, anything. I kind of like this game's mechanic where 
you spend your cards in hand to move. Mm -hmm. So then your turn has this interesting interplay of like, like as far as I can tell, the movement on the board, like which square, which which location action to take, is generally more important than the spells. There might be some powerful spells that I just haven't hit yet. Mm -hmm. They're like, you just need to spend your, your turn readying this spell and it's worth it. Yeah. But generally it seems like, no, the main action is just like, where are you going? And then, but you you might be swayed by like, oh, I really want to ready this spell. Uh, all right, what? I'm not going to ready a spell here. Um, I'm going to draw. I mean, Ben had thing. that spell that gave him two uh, points. Yeah. So. yeah, I saw Pass. one. I, I discarded one that's a time walk, too. Okay. Mm -hmm. I'm not untapping because I don't have to. I am going to go blue. Yep. We shall move to blue. We're fine. Getting a bit less fine, but we're still fine. Mm hmm. And I will roll for control. You did it! Hey, Matt. I did it. I missed it last time, but this time I'm going to remember. Uh, your curse was if you roll one or more uh, Cthulhu's. Uh, Cthulhu's on a single roll. Uh, your celebrations of the fact that you actually get to control this uh, uh, raise the attention of investigators. Uh, you, I place one of these homies for each uh, Cthulhu you rolled. It's just one. Your curse is All done. All right. Okay. Not as bad as I thought it might be. The so, curses seemed also very wildly in potency. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Yeah, I, some are terrible, oh like the one I got, and <laughs> yeah. other ones are meh. Yeah. Okay. I may take one face-up artifact or the top artifact from the artifact deck. Do you want to get rid of the ones here first? I want this one. Okay. Okay. Get a free spell and stuff. While runic chalk is in play, increase your spell reserve by one. And I may ready a spell for free. Mm -hmm. If you sacrifice it, right? If I sacrifice yeah. it. Uh, so we now have the Skull of Lore, which is tap it to just roll one dice. Uh, and if you get a... Uh, Cthulhu, you discard it and advance one on your summon track. Or uh, <laughs> if you get a, uh, a Elder Sign, you become cursed. <laughs> wow, exciting. <laughs> uh, or the Forgotten Tome, you can tap it. Uh, when another cult moves to the library, you get to draw two spell cards. Ooh. Those both seem kind of sweet. This one's wild. <laughs> yeah. I mean, you oh, only you only get to do point, it yeah. once, though, right? Yeah. To get the, the, the discard, thing. Yeah. Otherwise, it's just like... Yeah, but a, you don't, you, you don't, don't lose it to become cursed. So you can yeah. keep trying and maybe getting cursed. Yeah, yeah, I definitely want that. It's a fun little mini game. Mm -hmm. Okay, so I'm going to ready a spell. I am going to. Zelthia, that's correct. It's all ten, including the one at the top that doesn't have a number on it. Mm -hmm. So we're still three away from uh, Matt blowing up the board. Yeah, this is an interesting sort of gameplay mechanic in the way that it's like, I don't know if I can, like, you and I are definitely racing, like, we're all racing to get to the top, but I'm just like, oh, maybe it's within my, you know, best uh, interest to actually expose another cult. Right. And, uh... I, I do like in the uh, the rules, it's like, uh, the winner is, uh, it's like, whoever's got the, the high, farthest along the summon track, if there are two people with the same, it's whoever has the less uh, of the seals. Yeah. yeah. And if that all that if those are both the same, that it's like uh you uh you have a like a hollow shared victory. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> like yeah. it actually is like you have a victory, but it's kind of not. Yeah, good. it all kind yeah. of sucks. You yeah. didn't you don't want to share a victory. No, sharing That's not for why nerds. you got into cultism, right? So the chalk has been used okay. to ready a spell. Because cool. I was slightly short, and I don't know where we're discarding those yeah, two. Yeah, is there but... an actual discard pile once you've used something? Or no, I guess we'll just put it there. Should we start yeah. one? Yeah, because it's like, yeah. like, that wasn't and taken away from the museum. It was just, yeah. Now it's there, and now I'm using it. Are you casting it right away? Okay. The stars are right. Ooh. Assign each cult, including mine, one of the following. I will now lose one Elder Seal. Excellent. And for both of you, I could... Gain to, uh, or have you guys gain two people from the abyss? You're not going to. Uh, you could gain two investigators each. You're not going to. Instead, you're both going to become cursed. Uh, right. Well, it says I would assume one of oh one I get, of each. Uh, I get it, to do they choose. have to split them up. Assign each cult, including yours, one of the following. 
Sure. It doesn't say that you can't double. Doesn't up. say you can't double. That's up. true. Yeah. I'm fine right. with it. Yeah. Okay. So we're each becoming cursed. Is that yeah. what you said? Okay. Here you go. So uh, that's you, for you. So you read. I you, take and it, get, and then yeah. you take. And mine's for him. You. For you. Mine's for yours you. is for me. Yeah. Yours is for Nelson. Okay. Got it. Nelson hasn't been cursed yet. Right. Curse. I got on the team. Yeah. Been everybody's cursed been too. cursed once now. Oh yeah, Nelson from Loading Ready Run, the cursed mm. one. Well, okay. Okay. Keep that in mind. All right. And I All cannot right. ready a second spell, I believe, because that was still a spell that I readied with that thing. Uh, no idea. Yes, I think. Yeah, this yes. is just like paying yeah. costs. Yeah. yeah, yeah. No, sorry about the chalk. Yeah. Um, I do believe, though, that because I casted a spell in that location, this clears. That's a yeah, great question. That would, yeah. I think sure. that would make sure. sense. Yeah. Let's do it. And then okay. draw back up to three, and is that your turn? Probably. I draw one. Okay. All right. And great. That is my... So much magic. I love it. Mm -hmm. I would like to go to the library. I will pay a red and move the elder token. I, okay? I think that's actually that actually makes a lot of sense, Kushinoki. Mm, yeah. Yeah, everyone's uh, we've been getting a lot of love for Haster getting yellow because of the Oh the no. So oh, okay. I'm talking about that because the way that it's written to me, yeah, it also oh, makes sense. Oh the card. Right, where it's like assign each cult, including yours, one of the following. Oh, so you have to pick everybody one? gets the same thing. Oh. That hmm. Well wording it's fine. Like we can do let's call fantasy flight right well, now. So Sorry, or whoever made this the way game. that it's yeah. right the, the way that it's written is assign each cult, comma, including yours, comma, one of the following. But yes, yeah. I mean, there's there's several kinds of like interpretations. Interpretations. It's fine. Like for this, who cares? But yeah. yeah. Should we make him take a seal back and give him a curse? <laughs> no, it's okay. Is it more fun to do that or less fun? I always like to go in the way of like whatever we did. It's fine because it didn't game break it. Let's but not. Now for the let's future. not back up. Okay, yeah. but next time we play that broken seal card. Sure. Everybody we gets will the pick same. one thing, and because like the stars are aligning, right? So it's like. Yeah, no, I, I feel you. Yeah. I feel you. I felt a little weird about the way we Yeah, way the we double comma makes it an aside, right? But I, yeah, for sure. Yeah. Okay, so I came to the library. We're checking to see if there's three investigators. There are not. Now, we're going to bring one of these buddies and one of those buddies, right? Mm -hmm. Slap them down. I do have control of this area. When the cursed cult has at least four oh. cultists at a location, your lack of discretion has put Arkham on alert. Add all investigators to your lodge from the location with the most investigators. Uh, several so are tied. All tied, yeah. Do I pick, maybe? I guess, is it of the person with the curse's choice or the cursed person's choice? I would say probably you're in charge of it. Okay. Let's say... Here. I don't even think it matters. Sure. sure. Those, those buddies all come over here. Party in and out. Oof! I didn't Great. have to watch that curse for very long. Yeah. <laughs> Great. I feel super good about the fact that we did that that way. Uh, okay. Let's now uh, do what we do at the library. Draw three spell cards. Nice. One, Powerful. two, three. I may ready an additional spell this turn, and I can sacrifice cards from the library to ready a spell at no cost. Okay, I have to read these cards. Unfortunately, the library takes a minute. That's okay. Okay. Talk amongst mm. yourselves. Yeah. I'd rather not, though. <laughs> Man, I uh, I got this uh, silk shroud in the in like the hopes of being like protected from the cultists. I've not been receiving any cultists, <laughs> which right. is like totally fine. I mean, I guess maybe that's doing its job as a deterrent, which is kind of funny. I just haven't had a reason to go to the ceremony. More well, it's it, the streets are what gives you. Uh, well, I get from the right. ceremony my ability, which would send one to you as well. Yeah, yeah. And I also I've never gone to the streets. <laughs> mm-hmm. He's popping so, off. I like don't even want to get rid of one of my cultists to do this. Uh, so just that's as a, okay, right? As a quick note, I was looking at the the fact for the game. Yeah. Uh, it's the opposite interpretation. Is actually. Whoa! You have to split we, them up. You it, couldn't it, both get. It has to be a different thing for each, for each person. person. That's, that's what, what I figured other it thing was. That we thought. Yeah, I figured it was modal. Yeah. Okay. Do you want me to change that? Uh, it's, nah, I, it's fine. Definitely, we're, we're definitely now, don't care about it. We're way past now. But yeah, it's weird though that like it could be interpreted as. Like both, Choose one total. both yeah. opposites. Yeah, yeah, yeah. English. I, yeah, I figured it was modal. But, you know. Getting busts since I don't know the early 
Stone Age or whatever. Okay, I'm going to not do any of the fun things you do at the library except draw three cards. I have a red and a blue that I just okay. have access to. I'm only going to ready one spell. And then ones go away. I'm just going to get super raided. I draw one more card at the end of the turn, and I play my raid. It's the raid! I need five of these dice. There you go, I bud. I love it. I'm not the only one getting sealed. Yeah. Okay, I did roll one star, and then I rolled two good ones and two scratches. So the scratches, they leave. The star, they stay. And the other two, they go away. So you yeah. take three Elder Signs and one will stay. Okay, I might cast a spell. No! You've got your artifact there, too. Right? Oh, yes. Right. 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 Why Thank you. Thank you. Turn them all I, was try I was looking at my cards. I was going yeah. to remember. So I'm changing this one into this. And okay. then I'm going to... Yeah, this seems right. I might as well... Sure. I'll transmogrify uh, this. So should I take... Should I take a seal or a curse? I could move it to this and become cursed. Mm -hmm. Or sorry, and and get a seal. I only have one seal right now, so it kind of seems irrelevant. Or I could just move it to this or this and then take a curse. Mm -hmm. I'll just still take the seal, but just get the investigator out of there. Yeah. So I take two seals, but I get to get rid of all the... Everybody goes away. All the cops. Yeah. Get back in the dirt, cops. The popo's out of here. Yep. Okay, and then I've spent that spell, mm -hmm. and I've finished all my stuff. Go ahead. Great. Okay. Um, hmm. Yeah, so we my... still have one active curse? Oh, yes. Yeah, I have a curse for Ben. When something happens, woo, dun, something spooky. Dun, dun. When he wins the game, he actually loses. Hmm. Right? I bet that's a curse in here. <sighs> that would suck. But there is, probably, it, yeah. it does in the manual, I don't know what the curses are, but in the manual it does say, like, when somebody gets all of the, uh, all of their summon things, they win. Unless there's a curse. Yeah. <laughs> nice. Uh, hmm. You're at three, Particular hey? curse. Yeah, I still only have three victory points. Whoops. I grabbed a bunch of summon cards to hopefully have two in a row. Oh, I did. Good. So I can go to the purple place and get more victory points. Mm. Why would you ever want to go to the purple place? Sounds lovely. Prince's house. You know? The Purple Palace. Mm -hmm. Get your fancy basketball game on. All right. Um, Where do you go to get rid of investigators? Uh, can you move them off of your place on the streets of Arkham? You just have to suffer raids. I you think, you right? can go you can go to the streets of Arkham and take them off of your. They don't always have to come uh, from the supply. They can come from your lodge. Okay. Um, so I'm gonna spend this uh, gate okay. and go to the streets of Arkham. Well. Uh, check. Nothing's there. Bloop. And one of my dudes. Now you can control Bloop. it. I control it. Fun. Um, so I'm gonna take two homies from here and put them in Matt's area. Oh Great. boy. Love it. Um, and, uh, yeah, it's raid time. Okay. For me, Don't you, yeah. Are you, are you gonna do any spell stuff? That happens first, doesn't it? Or no, it doesn't. Yeah, yeah, it's, oh, it's yeah, part sorry, of the no, end sorry, of yeah. Yeah, yeah, they there and then Does a raid happen even though it's not Matt's turn? Yeah, yes, it happens the, because of the so the action of this place is yeah. oh, right, take two, yeah, yeah. and then they everybody yeah. besides Sorry, you confused. gets raided. Not your raid because you have five. Yeah. Bad. Holy moly! Yeah, Matt, uh, you're gonna be taking four elder signs. One's gonna stay. Oh boy. Uh, which would end the game. Mm. <laughs> Anyone have any? I don't. Any, uh, I used effects? it on my turn. Sorry, I don't have a thing. Matt, you got found out. Is, do we have anything else to? Say about it? No. Is, is there is there a, a check? Exactly set? The game, what I wanted to the happen. Game happens. ends immediately. All right. Fair enough. I have been sealed away. Nyarlov Tap is no more. I've got the and I've got the highest summoning score right now. Yeah. Okay. There it is. An anonymous well, tip. Yeah. Uh, led uh, <clears throat> the investigators. Oh. Yeah. <laughs> GG, y'all. That's what you can do at the streets of Arkham. Uh, you can push the investigators on other cults, right? Yeah. 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 Um. It is seven o'clock. Right now. Okay. Uh, it's up to... Uh, so th this game is supposed to take 30 minutes to half an hour. We could reset and do another one with an hour left in the stream um, with the intention that maybe we might go 50 minutes over. Is anyone comfortable with Th that? Or do 30 you minutes to here? an hour and a half, do you mean, or something? You said 30, 30 minutes, minutes to an hour. It's like the hour? recommended game time. Um, I'm fine. It's 7? I know, I know yeah. you, you're on dad time. 
No, it's okay. Yeah. Oh, yeah, sure. I'll let you guys know what the curse is. I, I kind of hinted at it. I asked to see if he wanted to cast a spell before things happened. But yes. that, that was a coming up next. It's, if he casts a spell, I get to cancel it and then give him oh. three um, three investigators. Oof. And a raid. And they initiate a raid. Wow. So, okay. So that was the curse. Hey, for, guys. Uh, what do you think, Paul? Uh... I feel, I feel like I feel like another game will be like you. Fact, it took probably. it took a while to explain it at the beginning and stuff. So I, I feel like you guys Maybe now that you guys have got it yeah. all figured out, you can yeah. go a lot I'm faster. I'm fine with it. Yeah, cool. I mean it's past bedtime now, so it doesn't. All matter. right, yeah. then Papa's staying up to play board games. <laughs> yeah, here we go. All right, uh, don't go away, friends. We're gonna take a break. We're gonna pick uh, some new gods, and uh, when we come back, more uh, more fate of the elder gods. Yeah, see cool. you shortly. Ooh, and welcome back to AFK here on the Loading Ready Run Network. I'm Ben, and joining me is Nelson. It's Nelson. And Matt. Yeah. And uh, we're ready to get into game two of Fate of the Elder Gods. Uh, I Nobody managed to summon their gods. We just managed to get Matt in trouble. We got Matt exposed. Yeah, and, and, uh, ben and was closer to victory, so he won. Yeah. So now we're going to do uh, another game with a new set of gods. And uh, these are really, really interesting ones. I'm kind of pumped for this. Uh, Nelson, who are you playing? I don't know how to say it, but we're gonna go with Sathogwa, the Sleeper of Naka. So this is a giant sort of frog, pig, beast. He's got all kinds of yeah, all kinds of folds. He's making me feel better about the progress I've made in my dieting and uh, exercise routine. <laughs> it's clearly not got the same priorities health wise that yeah, I do. Yeah. You know, he's not pre-diabetic, or if he, you know, is, he's got his own. His own plan for for dealing with that. Yeah. So, anyway, what is your ability? His Nelson? power is called slothful sacrifice. I can remove up to two cultists from another cult's lodge. That's the like reserve, and place them in my lodge. Weird. Um, or I devour another cult's uh, cultist from my lodge because I've gotten them from previously and advance one on my summon track. So that's pretty like, sweet. So, so, like, that, so that requires two activations to actually yeah. do. Yeah. It. So but... every other time I go to the ceremony. I can get victory points. Yeah. <laughs> Worth noting that um, Devour is a mechanic that we haven't used yet. Right. Devour means it's gone, out of the game. It doesn't go back to the Abyss. It's not getting sacrificed or dying. It is literally, it is, you've, you've, that, that, that cultist is out of here. Goes it's, in my belly and very, stays yeah. there. So we'll just put the Devoured ones in the, in, on the big pig frog belly. Yeah. And that's where they He's go. He's num yeah. Uh I am playing uh, Ithaqua, uh, the Wind Walker. Uh, it, it's a big Windigo. It's a really big windigo, so I do icy stuff. Um, so I have these uh, I have these winter squall tokens that go onto the board. Um, so whenever uh, I uh, go to do my uh, to, to to do a ceremony and I activate oh, my oh, ability, yeah. I remove all winter squall tokens from the board. Then I shuffle them up, draw three, and look at them, and I place those tokens on three different locations. Oh, okay. Uh, then I get to destroy a investigator or a cultist in each of those locations. Okay. Uh, and then whenever a cult, a cult, any cult, even myself, activates a location with a winter squall token, you reveal the squall token, apply the effects, uh, and then you discard it. Neat. Oh, so the squall tokens have, like, text in they're the like back spells, of them? Yes, like on the back yeah. of them. They have their little mm. trappies that I can play. That doesn't seem fun. Mm. Ah, it's for fun me. for me. It's me. Yeah. I'm in the eye of the beholder, yeah. and I behold in the tokens. Yeah. Cool. Um, I'm Bokrug because I'm really mad about being sealed away, so now I am the great water lizard with the power of blasphemous vengeance. Okay. I choose any one cult to become cursed. That's just straight it. up. That's it. No, you just curse someone. Just yeah. deal, deal a curse to one of us every time he hits to, the ceremony. Wow. I mean, to be fair, cursing somebody seems like something that you should be doing. Yeah, yeah the, yeah, the sure. curses are pretty messed up, too. Like, some of them are really bad. Yeah. yeah. Um, and, uh, yeah, all right. I mean, we we know what to play, so we should just get we into it. We set up in the first half of this episode, yeah. Yeah. Uh, I, I won, so we just figured Matt and Nelly got to go first. So, Matt, take it away, buddy. Uh, red. All right, so Matt's going to go to the red zone. The library. Library's where everyone went last time, too. Primarily oh, me. You yeah, get to draw sorry. cards one, in the beginning, yeah. One thing nice. I should mention, uh, we have two, two new museum artifacts, oh. both of which are really cool. Uh, we have the mistranslated manuscript, which is you can get rid of it, to cancel a raid. Choose another cult and initiate a raid on their lodge. Then you roll one die, and if you get a 
uh, a, 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 a elder sign or star. An elder sign or star, then you become cursed. Yeah. Or the uh, wizard's grimoire. Uh, your minimum hand size is five. Mm. So you drop to five. Like yeah, which seems pretty tight. Uh, so library, I'm gonna roll for control. Okay. Thank you. I get control. Uh, you do. Yeah. Control. Yeah. All right. I also draw. should put people. <laughs> right. Draw three. Draw mm -hmm. three. You You're allowed ring. to cast one of them without fulfilling requirements, right? Or do you have to sacrifice a guy? So he gets, yeah, he gets to ready an extra one, and then the control thing is, is he can sacrifice a homie yeah. there to uh, ready one for free. Ooh. Sacrifice a good homie. A good homie. Working for evil. Yeah. Just these, sacrifice yeah, these are just free. good homies yeah. working for evil. That's right. Yeah, even the term good homie is still kind of ambiguous. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Mm. So, what do I have there that I could... You got a red and a yellow. Red and yellow, that won't work, but I'm going to sacrifice a homie. Mm-hmm. To... Uh, a good homie. Mm-hmm. Three white is... is sure. It doesn't matter, three. yeah. I have a white one there. And that is my turn. That, uh... And that goes away. Yeah, it goes around. Draw back up to three. One. Oh, yeah, draw one. Sorry, bro. And then... You don't have five. Okay, great. It's my turn. I want to go to the museum. Okay. There are not three cult, three investigator ladies there right now. Let's mm -hmm. put one more in as well as one of my buds. Let's see if I gain control of the museum. I don't. So let's instead just grab one of the ones that's on display. I think I'm going to grab this wizard's... The grimoire seems wizard's pretty good. Wizard's grimoire. Yeah. have five cards instead of three this game. See how that goes for me. Seems pretty I liked, good. I like the look of the other one too, but I'm a little more excited about this one. All right, we have the lamp, which was that one that you can roll three dice, and for each scar or uh, sign that you get, you uh, gain an elder sign, but then you get to take an extra turn. Okay. Uh, or the shining trapezohedron oh, yeah. that uh, Matt had last oh, time, okay. which... Uh, Gives you a couple of cool things. Movement, right? mm -hmm. Okay, I can't cast a spell with what's available here, almost, mm -hmm. but not quite. And although I do want to say that all three of my cards, the beginning of this game, my, my spell cards had the same requirement, <laughs> oh. but there wasn't a consistent pattern of which color comes first. Oh. And it just made my skin around my brain crawl. <laughs> <laughs> so that's a weird little Magic the Gathering problem to have. Okay, mm -hmm. I'm going to grab. Up to five cards here at the end of my turn, and so go. Now, All right. Now you know how chat feels uh, when they're like watching and people don't like lay out their land in uh, yeah. Proper, yeah. the proper order. That's right. Yeah, I probably have earned this from playing on stream with my lands in various piles. Hey, friends. Yeah. I'm going to use this white, I'm going to go to the ceremony. Uh -oh. Fun! Let's make snow happen. Yeah, so, check. Yep. Not a, not not too many not there. Too many ladies yet. <laughs> I'm there. Uh, <laughs> sure, I will roll for control. You also get princes, but yeah. I do not. I get a, a warp, and uh, yeah. Ability. So I remove all of the ones that are there. There are none. I shuffle these on up. Let it snow, let it snow, let it and snow. And I draw three. One, two, three. I get to look at them and then put them where I would like. Oh, so you get to actually see where they're going. Yes. Nice. Um, okay. I'm going to go... Let's say... There. Library. Mm. There. So, so you get three yeah. at random, but then you get to read them and choose which one goes where. Yeah. Cool. Yeah. Um, I don't even know how severe these are. And there. Yeah. The streets of Arkham. Fun. Okay. And then on each of those ones, I can choose to destroy a uh, investigator or a uh, cultist. Okay. Uh, so I'm going to destroy your cultist. Sure. I'm going to destroy your cultist. Great. And I'm going to destroy, I don't know, let's say your cultist. Great. Okay, uh, that's that's my ability. Um, I can now ready a spell. I got access to white, blue. Um, you could have cast every card in my hand last game. 
Our last turn. Uh, I am not going to ready anything. Instead, I'm going to draw one back up to three and uh, pass say the turn. Matt. All right. Nothing to unexhaust. Uh, I am unfortunately going to go to blue. Okay. What happens? Or say, yeah. Well, check. We're okay. fine. People Add go things. there. Mm -hmm. When does this act? Now. Now. Okay. When you activate the ability of that place. Okay, so then we're in this this part. <laughs> no effects. Yeah. Oh, okay. All right. They don't all do stuff. Okay. okay. Nice. There's some blanks for space. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Getting me to feel weird about this. Okay. Roll for control. Please. You just you put on another sweater. It's fine. No. All right. All right. Museum. Do, do you want your shiny rock again? <laughs> Is that what you're here for? Or do you want That's the, my diamond. Or do you want the time warp? Yeah. I want the shiny rock. Oh, rock. I right. love it. See you later, Lampy. That genie is never getting out of there. No, yeah. it seems like nobody wants the genie. All right, we've got uh, true magic with a K. Uh, you can tap it to discard a spell in your reserve, then draw the top spell of the spell deck and immediately ready it for free. Fun. You got to do some wild magic stuff in there. Yeah. Mm. Uh, uh, or uh, chamber's journal. You tap it. Choose any one location and roll one die. On a tentacle or a Cthulhu head, you add one um, investigator from your lodge to that location. On a uh, Elder Star, you add one, one investigator from that location to your lodge. Okay. Great. Is that nice. a tap or a sacrifice? It's a tap. Oh, interesting. So it's 50-50. Yes. Either. You get rid of You can dump stuff. And I will... Uh, ready a spell. Sorry, I should show. Sure. Yeah. Blue, Prove white, it. Blue, white, yellow. Perfect. Blue, white, yeah. yellow. That's exactly what it does. Mm -hmm. All right. And that is my turn. Okay. Uh, I think I want to just go to. Yeah. Did you draw back? Draw a oh, card. Oh, sorry. Draw one. Yep. Thing I keep forgetting. Oh, I want to keep that one. Okay, let's pitch both these yellow ones, probably, because I think I like them less. Yeah. Oh. Yeah. I'm going to put two yellow down to go anywhere uh, I want. Anywhere right? you want. I'm going to go to the green place. Gather in some homies. There are not yet three of nope. the bums that we don't like there. We Rude. Put two of these on. We will try to gain control. We will fail. You do not. And then we will get some guys from our abyss. Is it three? Sorry. Yep. And three. you can move one. These from... just come here, right? Yep. And then you can move one from the gathering to somewhere else. There's none in the streets of Arkham right now. Um, what's the Gathering's special ability again? Move any number from the Gathering? Okay, so that's not that big a deal. Having control of this place doesn't really matter. Sure. Why not? I'll just put someone else in the other world. Seems that's, like the place to go, yeah, yeah. Exactly. Okay. And then I might be able to ready a spell for a green and a blue. I can, actually. Okay. Sorry. Right. I should. Green and a blue. Green and blue. Yep. Yeah. And then I'll. Draw it back up to three, and then I'm done, right? Yeah, you discard the oh, right, astral right, 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 column right. there. Sorry. I haven't cast a spell yet this game. Draw back up to five. five. Sorry, yeah, draw three more. Go ahead. Holy, yeah. that's the great. Wizard's Grimoire doing okay. <laughs> Seems pretty good. Hey, look at that. Like, I have two of the same one again. It's yeah. like, why bother going to the library now? Yeah. Yeah, I think I don't have to. You have a whole library in that one book. You have this. This is the library, yeah. Although mm. you get to ready two spells in case you wanted to do that. Oh, that's true. Yeah. yeah. Um, the wizard's grimoire can't do everything, but it can do enough. It doesn't. It doesn't like really help you ready spells. It just helps you. Well, it does, I guess. Yeah. Yeah. You hmm. don't even have to activate it or anything. Yeah. I mostly just got it because I thought, hey, this is gonna help me move to wherever I want to return. Because I'll probably have two of the same. Yeah. Right. right. Yeah, that's true. Hey, you don't really need to work for warps. Anymore. Right, yeah. I'd pr well, the thing is, uh, is where I might just want to go to the ceremony because it also helps me get... Um, yeah, your special is pretty awesome, Yeah, too. the special. Although, yeah, I don't know. Is it any faster than just going to the other worlds? I mean, you have to roll dice to get the... Yeah. To, to successfully sacrifice. It's only on a six that you get to get victory from the other worlds. I'm going to... No, you you get in the other in the outer worlds you get either uh, either the tentacle or the Cthulhu. This is really difficult. I got some. Oh, okay. I thought it was just the Cthulhu. In the is outer it, worlds. In the other worlds, is it just? 
Uh, no, you're right. Oh no. Yeah, it's okay, cool. cool or tentacle. Oh right, and then if you rolled, if you Cthulhu rolled... is and you have control, then yeah. you guys back right. to your logical. Um, go so, for yeah. it. I'm gonna use this gate and go to the other worlds. Uh, check in. Oh, too many homies there. I'm gonna try and get control. You do not. I do not. Uh, all right, I got two homies there. Send some homies to their reward, hopefully. Uh, no, neither two one. Wow. Bummer. Yikes. Well, Wait, no, it's not a cool it? Oh, No, know. there was okay. two. Okay. There was okay. two, okay. Uh, two stars. Yeah. Darn. Okay. It's not... All right, well, that honks, but maybe I can ready a spell or two here. It's like still a decent use of a turn, just yeah. to put one of your cultists in there. It's like, like, that's uh, what I did with my he, turn. Kind of. Hey, cultists, I, I think you guys are kind of missing the point yeah. of this yeah. whole operation. We need operation. to have a staff meeting. Cultists, uh, if you could just, everyone, get into the break room. We're going to talk about what we do in the other world. I'm readying this uh, red, red, blue from the uh, yep. air. Checks out. I always got access to a blue. Uh, then, uh, yeah, that's uh, that's me, homie. So I'm going to draw a card and pass it over to Matt. Pass it on over to me. Uh, you think that's how I sound? <laughs> <laughs> yes. <laughs> the uh, elder gods have been with each other for long enough now that the barbs have come out. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. It's got to be tough being an eternal being, locked away in the private realms with the other eternal beings. Yeah. Constantly trying to get a good enough spot on the bed. <laughs> and, uh, you know, continually arguing over whose socks it is that smell that bad. Going to the gathering. Yep. Magic. Oh, did you, sorry, the red and blue should be gone from you. you yep. spell that. Good call. Right? Yeah. Mm -hmm. It's hard to remember to do that. Roll for control. Did you put things in? Oh, sorry. Yeah. Because, yeah, there's going to be too many investigators in the well, gathering. Well, not the gathering point. Cultists too many from? cultists at the green gathering point. Nope. No control. Now, I shall return three of my people from the abyss to my lodge. Yeah. And I may move one of my people from the gathering to any location. Any single to one. Other world. Makes sense. That's where the party is. And now I will ready a spell. Will you? Uh, green, yellow. Has sure. been readied. All right, the warp goes away from the gathering. And I draw. Matt's got a full stack. Nice. And you. Okay, I will. That's a wizard lizard over there. Yeah. <laughs> oh, that one's really good. Oh, they're all really good. I know. I like all of these things. <laughs> Where are you gonna go? Uh, I think I'll keep that. You draw draw it at the end of turn, Matt. I did. Yeah. Okay, nice. I'm gonna spend two green. To go back to the other worlds. Makes sense. Checking. We're good. Culting up. You get to roll three Having dice. Control. Yeah, you have control too. Attempting to win the game. Not doing very good at it. You get to sacrifice it's, up to one. Yeah, I just get one. I mean, I got one point. And yeah. I didn't roll any Cthulhu heads, so I don't get any buddies back. You're one ninth of the way there. I have a green, a red, and an anything. So, I could do either one of these two. That's not bad. Hmm. What feels uh, good, though? Winning feels better than not losing. So, I'll just use <laughs> red and a white. Yeah. Because I have a red and there's a purple. So, and I'll ready this yellow one. And then I will sacrifice this green thing to do yeah. that. Because that's how that works. And I'll draw back at the five. And then it's Ben's turn. Um, okay, uh, I'm gonna spend these double Winning. yellows. One point, Paul. I made it. I did nice. sacrifice one cultist for victory. These double yellows. Okay. Uh, I'm going back to the ceremony. Seems oh, good. I get a thing. Yeah. Always and forever. The shiny uh, rock yeah. provides warp tokens. Check in. Moving all these friends in there. I get a warp, and uh, I control this thing now. You get to snow it up. Yep. Um, or... Yeah, I get to do so many things now. Right. Uh, so yeah. we're gonna snow it up. Gonna remove these tokens. You don't get to know what they are. Nope. Mystery tokens. Mystery tokens. What's inside the snow? Oh God. Uh oh. Uh oh. Yeah, they're uh -oh. Gonna be held in the Elder Juggalos. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Juggala. I mean, Sathogwa definitely looks like we could stripe his face up and he would do whatever dance move it is the Juggalos do. 
mm. all of them at yeah. the same time. Yeah, exactly. He's ready to like take his whole family to a music festival that's just in some farmer's field and pitch a tent there and then not want to leave. Yeah. yeah. Maybe start a second family while there. <laughs> and then, and then eat everyone. Four. Him him in particular, then eat all of them. Yeah. Um, How many jugglos are already in this weird frog's belly? He can't keep track of all of them and juggling that memory, you know? Yeah. Uh oh. The snow is coming down. I'm assuming you don't trigger your own. Oh, he does. Oh, he does. Anytime. Yep. Anytime anybody yeah. goes on so there. Can, oh, cool. He can decide it was, it was ill fated. Yep. Uh, yeah. All right. So I'm going to go ahead uh, and destroy, say, one of your homies sure. from here. Uh, I'm going to destroy a investigator oh. from here. Uh, and I will destroy an investigator from here as well. Okay. Okay. Neat. Where do I want to go? Once you're done yours. Uh, all right. And uh, now I can do spells and stuff. Get into some real whiz biz. Doing spells. Um. I will choose not to do that. I'm gonna just draw the two and pass away the turn. On tap. No. Mm. Oh, I can do this. Okay. I appreciate that the, the cultists are like bright and fabulous, yeah. whereas the investigators are like all drab. Yeah. yeah. They're not they're not fun. Library time. I will add a people and I will roll for dominance. You got it. Looks like okay. the investigators have control of this location right now. Nope. Yep. Not happening, Captain. Draw three spell cards. Yeah. You can ready an extra spell if you'd like. If I'd but like. You're not mm -hmm. to go, allowed to go up to a fourth, are you? Nope. nope. Okay, so I would have to activate something. First. Maybe you want to cast a spell first. Yeah, who knows? Yeah. Or maybe you just want to hold a whole bunch of cards in your hand. Mm hmm. Uh, oh, right. I didn't do my control thing. Is everybody cool if I back it up and kill one of these homies? Yeah. yeah. That, that just gets I, you a victory, or what? Yeah, it just gives me a victory. Sure. Why, is everyone abyss? okay uh, with yeah, that? Yeah, it's I fine. was like, does it go to your lodge or the abyss? It goes to the abyss. Yeah. yeah. All right, I'm at one. I think it's two. Is it sacrifice two dudes? Two. Yeah, I will still do that. Yes. Yep. Yeah. Right. Sorry, I keep thinking that you only get to because I did because I I rolled for control the first time. I keep thinking that you only get this if you have control. Yeah. But that's just what you you get to do your ability every time you go to the ceremony, and you only get to advance your track mm -hmm. if you have control. Yeah. Okay. Cool. Did you get your gate card? You get a gate card, too. I did. Yeah, I got okay. one. Okay, great. Yep. I'm not actually going to activate any spells. Yeah. You okay. have to get rid of your one of your, your spells you already have down if you want to. So. Well, I have none that I want to. Um... So you just draw one more card and you're done? Yeah. Okay. All right. Sweet. Here you go. Simple turn. I'm going to pay two yellow yep. to go back to green to the gathering. Okay. Check in. Checking. I get to have all these friends. Oh, so many buds. You love friends. Come on over. It's a party in here. And then we get one of these and one of these. Mm -hmm. And then I get to roll for control. Miss. No control. So I just... Rolling very well for that this time. No, that's okay. That's okay. I just get three guys, right? Still from the abyss to my lodge. Yep. And then abyss you get to, to move lodge. your friends. And I can move one back over to the other worlds, I think. Yeah, makes sense. Mm -hmm. And then I'm going to cast a spell. I have one that costs three green. Okay, and yeah. It's just three green here. What so. is it? It's a green one. Oh, sorry, you said cast a spell. Oh, yeah, sorry, I meant ready to spell. Although, I kind of do just want to cast it right now. I'm going to cast it soon. Like, should I do it now or later? Yeah, well, let's just... Let's just do it now. It's fine. I guess maybe I'm supposed to wait in case I need to... No, but it matters where I am when I do it. Let's just do it now, because I don't mind losing the guy here. It's an ancient stirring. Advance one on the summon track. Ooh. You, you may sacrifice one of your cultists. Oh, yes, this one. At your current altar location to advance one more of the summon track. So it's two victory points. This is a right up to very, three. very powerful spell. Yeah. And I think I'm happiest to lose the cultist that's at the gathering. Uh, I draw back up to five, and I'm done. Mm. Wow. Yep. 
just racing along this victory track with me. Yeah. Yeah. Just to double check, uh, your special ability that munches the guys, you only munch other cultists, not investigators. Yeah, you have right? to do another cult cultist. Yeah. So yeah, my my hero power, whatever my um, hero what, power, my particular gods, whatever the opposite of a hero power. Yeah, is. my yeah my <laughs> enemy power is whenever I'm at the ceremony, I can munch or I can remove somebody else's cultist from their lodge, and then uh, once I've done that once, I can then eat them for victory. These go away at the end, and you drew a card at the end, right? You drew three, oh, yeah. right. I drew up to five. I can use this warp. I'm going to cool. go oh, to the you. streets I've got, I've got of Arkham. Streets of Arkham. Yeah. yeah. Put a friend there. Um, hmm. Rolling for control, or? I guess, yeah, you do the other thing first. Do you, or? Uh, oh, right, yeah, no, I guess. Yeah, I'll this. roll for control. Yeah. Okay. No control. So now... Am I getting two, or is Matt getting two, or are we taking one? Um, I have three. I think I'll give you two. All right. Oh. Let's party. He is the one that's winning right now. He gets five. Okay. I think I might... Oh, this doesn't actually work, does it? Okay, I have this cubes of power spell. Okay. But I think I just don't want to use it when I'm raiding because it's just we're just counting how many scratches we get. Is that the one that gives you two, two extra? extra? But that, wait, that would just be bad. Would it? Okay, but like, would it also? Maybe it just doesn't work because it's like what happens on a, on a scratch or a star is that. Like it just doesn't even make sense. Like say I roll an equal number of stars and and Cthulhu heads, it's like, they all want to leave and want to stay at the same yeah, time. Yeah, like it breaks the me. game. Let's just not use it. It's fine. It's fine. I, I was like, <laughs> I, I don't actually I, know how it would work. I knew yeah. I had a dice rolling one, so I'm like, let's roll. Let's make my dice rolling better. But I think it's like not gonna work. Yeah. Okay, I will just do this straight up. We got Ooh. a whole bunch of stars. So I've got two that get to leave, and I'm getting four seals. Right? Yes. Two leave, four Ooh. seals. Yeah. That was a pretty, pretty big raid. <laughs> that frog leg guy, he's up to something. <laughs> okay, one, two, three, four. Holy moly. Yeah. Okay. Uh, I mean, I have the most victory points, so I should probably just try and be racking these up. Yeah, I didn't control it, so... Um, if, if you're the one who gets... Oh, right, I don't win. No, oh, right, yeah. I don't win. Right, right, right. Okay, sorry. And, uh, I remember it at the end of the game. Yeah. I'm going to use this, yeah. uh, this... This. I'm going to ready yellow, this spell. Yellow, 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 blue, yellow, blue. blue, blue. You got a yellow or yellow, oh, yellow blue. Oh shoot! Oh, no, yeah, you. I goobered it. Yeah. You goobered. Oh. Oops. Well, Oopsie. you've got you've got blue, blue, yellow. Yeah. Do you I have yellow, blue, or blue, blue? No. Because um, I've got a blue, 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 blue for you. That's me yeah. crying. Yeah. Dutch comic book. <sighs> God damn it! Sorry, bud. Sorry, my dude. Bippity boppity boo. My mm. sub goes to you. Thanks solely to your fifty-two ten. We'll thank you again later. Okay, um... Yeah, right, yeah, I, I guess I will. feel so bad for you after you just hooked me up four seals. <laughs> I it's gotta be cards. really sad not uh, to cast and, that spell uh, in your hand. Yeah, I'll pass it. You poor, poor boy. Oh, okay. life is the worst. Yeah, where are you going? Where should I go? Where does the big, evil, winged octopus man take you today? Mm. Where indeed? I do like the like the the whole you know description of Cthulhu mythos things, because it's largely a cop out. It's like no one can describe them because they're too horrible. Check. Let's make a figurine of it. Yeah. <laughs> well, I mean, it's just oh. like a tentacle guy. Hmm. Roll. Oh, you need to take the effect of my thing. Right Is that now? first? Yeah. Sure. No effect. Okay. I love it. I like that it's kind of like. It's like a guts check. Yeah, You've got to yeah, be like, yeah. they so don't far. all do something. Yeah, yeah, we haven't revealed what any of the punishments are for these snow tokens. I yeah. know I saw one with more words than no effect. I didn't it would be a pretty did, big though. troll if they were no. just like all no effects. All no effects, yeah. But yeah, it's like, you need to play the game to find out. Did you move things in there yet? I put part? things in, I yeah. gain a gate card, I can do two because of my shining trap of his Adidron. Legit. <laughs> and then I activate my ability. In response. Mm-hmm. I'm going to sign of the Brotherhood. Oh, good. Matt, here. Oh. And I'll take three. Okay. <laughs> Thank you. Um, 
your curse. Yeah, Hooray! it worked. <laughs> so you're my cursor, right? I was gonna do it anyway because it's oh, part okay, of the law. Okay, fair, it's fair. It's fine, it's fine. <laughs> but you know, just greasing the wheels. Yeah, yeah. A little just little the bit. timing is yeah. important, right? Just before you activate your your, your curse uh, thing. Yeah. Uh, you know that little cursey thing you do. I'll just slip you a twenty. Yeah. That matters, you know? yeah, yeah. Uh, do I want to get any more spells going? You read my curse, though. Yes. Okay. Cool. Uh, I cannot actually get any of those going as they are. Oh wait, I'm reading the wrong one. Classic. We've all been there. Classic move. Uh, some of these spells suck. I don't really want to... Mm. These suck. Are the spells? Yeah. I mean, I'm going you can, to. Uh, you can discard stuff to move if you. Uh -huh. Yeah, I'm going to activate this now to okay. cast another spell. Sure. Yeah. Except it says at end of turn. You can't cast that then. Okay. You can cast like if you you can ready a spell and immediately cast that same spell. Mm. Like you can ready mm. a spell as long as you want to cast it immediately. Basically, if something's going to happen, you need to. If you want to ready a spell, you got to either discard one or use one now. I'll use this one, an Ancient Stirring, to advance one on the summon track. Mm -hmm. And I may sacrifice one of my current people at my current altar to advance one more on the summon track. So I'm at two. These. That goes there. Mm -hmm. And then I'll ready a spell. Where was it? Red White. Legit. So Makes you spend, sense. You spend those cards, they go right yep. here. Mm -hmm. And I draw one. Okay, I'm going to spend two blue to move to this paradise Guts of snow. Check. Let's find out. I figured it'd be something. All cults sacrifice one cultist from this location, then destroy one seal from their summon track. Wow. Okay, let's do that. Holy crap. So everybody loses oh. a guy from here. Sacrifice. Mm -hmm. That was the best for you. Yeah, that was really good for you. At least I lose this. Yeah, exactly. Sorry, At least I lose does it too. go to here? No. Oh, it's, it's right. It's destroyed. Like yep. And Kinda then you just get this yeah. back. Yep. Yeah, stop cheating so hard, Ben. I know, right? All right. Known I mean, cheatsman. I'm... And it has three people. Yep. It does. So does that happen next? Yep. Great. You get so your three people. Let's get. And then I, they raid immediately or what? No, at the and end of your turn. Yeah. Cool. And then you place a homie and anyone. Okay. I also want to mind switch. Okay. Swap one of my cultists, this one with another cultist at a different location. So I'm going to move this guy over here and take mats and put him in the library. Seems like good. So much. There you go. You're welcome. You almost had four. Yeah, I was trying to have four. Yeah. yeah. You, sh you stuffed me. Um, I'm going to use my other spell too, I think. Okay. And just cubes of Roll power. Roll two extra dice. Oh, I haven't even tried to gain control. I'll try. Yeah. Oh, wait. Do I have control now? Is that okay? Can we... I have, you do I, have control. I, I want yeah. that spell before I have control. Okay. Yeah. So now I have three cultists. I'm gonna roll two more to have five. Sure. And try to sacrifice them and then get them back from the abyss as well. You're you're rolling to add people there? Not to add. Uh, I'm rolling to eat them. So all right, from the looks of it, I got two Cthulhu heads. So you can one... sacrifice the entirety of the team, but two of them get to come back to your lodge instead of going. Yeah. So sacrifice three. Seems pretty good. So they all turn into victory points, right? Yeah. One, and two, three, two one, of them six, go to your... and then two of them come back to the launch. Yeah. Wow! And then I get a bunch wow. of seals in a second here. Okay, wait, I get to cast a spell first, right? I have yellow, yellow, anything? Mm -hmm. I think that might cast one of the things. Might... Yeah, I have one that's yellow, yellow. Yellow, okay. yellow! Okay, spend those. And, and then now I draw, there's a raid. I draw back up to five and then there's a raid? or there's a raid uh, Yes, first? you draw back up to five. Okay, one, two, three. And then we roll six dice. <laughs> and... Quite possibly end the game. It could, yeah. yeah. It's, I'm not going to win, even though I have six victory and points. So I break all my seals. Six. Yeah. Okay. Classic. Now, <laughs> you and you don't, you don't have anything to uh, mitigate dice rolls at the moment, do you? Ah, uh, no. He I did a spell. I read a spell, be. but it doesn't work for that. All right. No, it's just not that. Sorry, team. I don't think you'll get. I'm six. not trying to play too recklessly. This is just ha what has happened in this game. Yeah. I got Ooh. three. And See? I'm losing one of them, or four of them, right? So that's yes. cool. So I got three. Yep. 
which means That's you also six. become cursed. I'm cursed. Please I'll curse take a me. Second two, curse for you. Three, and then I get to. I'm only keeping two, so I keep two this time. Get to at least get rid of four of them. That's something. So you're at six seals. Yeah. Six seals. I can take four more seals before the game blows up. Okay. Do I have any curses triggering right now? Not right now. Great. It's your turn, Ben. Okay. Okay. Where do I want to go? There are two curses in play currently, right? Yeah. Both. Nelson has one. Nelson has two. I of have them. two. No, that's it. And, ne and neither of them have actually activated yet. Yeah. Matt's I suppose I'm not allowed. aware of them. I'm in love with you. I forget what I put under there. I suppose I'm not allowed <laughs> to look again. No. I think that that's seems the, I think totally that's unfair. Yeah. I think that's in the, the nature of it, right? Yeah, no, for sure. Um, hmm. Yeah, that snow is so old that even time has forgotten what will happen when you tread upon it. Very much so. But you desperately want the true magic, don't you? And do some more fun stuff. Thinking about it, yeah. Although, I need to slow you down. You're going real fast over there. Well, like, going to the streets of Arkham is the normal way that you interact with your opponents in this game, and that's just going to cause Matt to win. Yeah. Because, like, it does I mean, work. I'm, it yeah, does I'm work. Yeah, interesting <laughs> spot. Yeah. Yeah, you can kill me, and then the game ends. Hmm. I don't know. Can... There's a lot of cards right here. Which is weird. Why are there three cards here? Oh, right, just not casting spells. Mm -hmm. yeah. yeah, people keep going there and then not and being casting like, spells. You know what? No, I think yeah. we're good. Yeah, for sure. Uh, That's neat. You know... Mm -hmm. Do what feels right. I can't remember how bad it could possibly be. I'm going to the museum. Fun, let's find out. Uh, gain two seals. Okay. That would have been real bad for Nelly. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. What's the natural those way? Are, to... Those are pretty harsh, though. Yeah. yeah. What's the What's the natural way to break the seals again? Is it also in the museum, or? Uh, yeah. You can. Yeah. You yeah. can go through the go museum. You, you have to have control your... of it. Yeah, yeah. Control of the museum is what you need. And so then you sacrifice your cultist. To... Uh, yeah. yeah. I think I did it once last game. You had control last time. Uh, yeah, no, yeah. I don't get it. Um, I think I want. True magic's pretty cool. Sure, why not? I'll take true magic. True magic, gone. So what does that do again? Chambers. Uh, I can discard a spell in my reserve, then draw the top spell from the spell deck and immediately ready it for free. And now we have available the Enchanted Cane, which is tapped to reroll one of your dies. Mm -hmm. Or the Silk Shroud of Atlaknaka. Which That's is the one the I had shroud last time. that he had before. Cool. Yeah. That enchanted uh, cane is pretty hot. Hmm. Hmm. Uh, all right. I'm going to ready this spell that is blue, yellow, yellow, yellow. Blue. yellow. Um, and then that is my turn. I will draw and pass through. So I don't need to untap. Uh, I could just warp wherever I want, actually, technically, if I wanted to. Uh, where if do that I, was your will. Where mm -hmm. do I actually want to go? Green. Going to green. Ooh. Welcome back to the bloop. gathering. A bloop and a bloop, and a uh, roll for dominance. Just blooping all over the place there. Yeah. Empty this out. Come on. I would say no. Yeah, that's a no. A little cocked? Yeah. yeah. Uh, I gain three people. Yep. There they and go. I move one. Wherever I want from, from, from there. the gathering. Doesn't matter, so. I'll move it to other worlds. That seems to be the place that they go. Yeah, people are into that. Yeah. I could see maybe also the value of putting them on the ceremony. Mm -hmm. What do I have here that I want to it's do? It's one of those things where if you have two over there, it's a. The so last game, like the the hero that I played, sorry, the god, the elder god that I played, oh, you casting, casting a spell to gain some victory there. Oh, okay. Getting one victory, up nice. to three. Uh, and then I'm going to reserve a spell that is... And you sacrifice two dudes, yeah. I sacrifice two. Yep. Uh, yellow, green, that's a wild card, so I can mm -hmm. do that. Got it. Yep, spend that wild card. 
Bloop. And this is towards the end of my turn. Uh, I'm going to enlighten the faithful by uh, moving up to three of my people from any one location to any other location. Mm. What do you want to do? You can take two from... Oh, no, that's not you. One location. You can take so. two from museum or library and put them in the, the other world's hand. I feel like museum. Cool. Seems good. And I'll draw one. And that is my turn. Okay. I'm going to spend... Oh, I thought those were both here. No, it's these here. These two, right? I'm going to spend two white to go to the other worlds. Trying to keep it simple, stupid. In here. response to you moving to the other worlds. Oh boy, we're I'd like stack. to use my spell confound. Okay. I'm gonna move all these homies from here into here. This is just how much what Ben wants for you to win this time. <laughs> confound is move yeah. a bunch of investigators. I am the narc cool. in the land of cults. Great. Okay, so now we check and there are enough. So yeah. I get them all. You get four. Hooray! Okay. Love it. Now we take another narc and one of my boys and yep. put them in there. And then I get to roll a die, right? Ithaqua, he who narks on his yeah. exactly. <laughs> friends. Oh, I check for control. I'm Checking. just setting up math. Got control. Oh, okay. Not a big deal. Not a big deal. Now I just get to roll one die, see if I can sacrifice my cultist. And then also if it's another uh, squid head, then I yeah. get one back. It was. Squid head. Nice. So I get to move them here and then here and then I got Boost one. to seven. Point. Cool. And now I get to end the game and lose. Okay. Maybe. What does this do again? Right. That doesn't really help. Cool. I was doing trying to cast spells that would help in the future. Okay, I need five more dice. <laughs> oh, wait. Sorry, I do the spells thing first, right? It raids at the very end. Right? Yes, yeah. the very so last very thing last you do. Thing so you can ready a spell to help you. So, you. yeah, if you've got a spell you can cast immediately, no, that would help No, they're you. all just things that curse you guys. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to ready a spell with a blue and a red. Sure. Blue and a wild. That's probably why I went to that spot. This is like a spell I could cast. Uh, but neither of these fix my dice. They just F you guys up and move my guys to the other world. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Been focusing too hard on winning, I guess. For Ben, needed me to interact more. Hey, I mean, it's 753. I'm yeah. just making sure we all get on ho at Five home more time. dice, please. Yeah. Hey, I said I could play another game. That means <laughs> I get to tilt out about another game. <laughs> <laughs> all right. <laughs> Come on, I, I frog boy! You. Don't get four seals. Uh, Whoa! One, two. Only got two, and I'm I'm kicking out everyone but one. Uh, everyone but two. Oh, they're both. Sorry, I thought yeah. one of them was a scratch. Okay, okay. So two are staying. There's always two invest. There's always two cops left. Yeah. Okay, and I'm getting two seals. Damn. The game this is still on. on. The game is on. The game is afoot, sir. <laughs> I draw back up to five, and it's your turn. Uh, we spent that one, right? Yeah. That happened. Okay, great. We're alive. He's like Teflon. <laughs> yeah. just can't find him. Teflon with eight seals. Yeah. Go ahead. All right. Um, Actually, gonna... I probably want to cast a spell on your turn. No, sure, not. go for it. They're going to end up getting you on ta no, no, tax no. evasion or something. Yeah. Exactly. <laughs> uh, no, right. I'm not. I'm going to spend this white. I'm going to go over here. Oh. Boy, 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 boy. I get... Oh, no, I'm full. <laughs> Yeah. Um, so I take the, the friends. I'll put some friends here. I'm going to roll to take control. Oh, I... No, go ahead, go ahead. Sorry. Okay. I do not get control. Um, all right. Uh, gain a warp, if you don't mind. Warp. Thank you very much, friend. Uh, shuffle these on up. Jesus. Oh. These are not ideal for uh, shuffling. Yeah, really. Yeah. Shuffling them each time. All right. Maybe just One, get two, your opponents three. to pick th three face down. Or that something. might be the best yeah, way to do it. Time. Yeah. Okay. It's weird. This game, I don't think I've had a single investigator. And last game, I always had them. Yeah, I was just saying, like, last game, I, I was trying to say I had, like, all of my pieces out on the board in locations, except for, like, a couple in the abyss. Mm. And this game, I have currently two cultists in locations. Yeah, the uh, the different, um, uh, uh, like, I don't know if it's the just different play styles or the different uh, actual uh, gods that you're working with that change the sort of mm -hmm. play situation. Yeah. 
But Nelson's definitely drawn the aggro this time, both from the players and from the investigators. Right. Yeah. <laughs> Go like Zo. Uh, so from here, uh, I will destroy this friend. Sure. From here, I will destroy that friend. Oh, and really? from here, I will destroy that friend. Yeah, I mean, my guys being all dead is partly due to Ben's ability too, not just my, my yeah. ability. Yeah. You're putting them in the abyss, right, when they die? Oh, you were... I was just handing them to you. No, no, Most no. of my game has just been this wizard's yeah. grimoire. Like, this did they, is the did you guys go to the abyss when I killed them? Sorry. Yes. The one. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. I put my guy in the abyss. Okay. Uh, yeah. I can ready a spell. Are you not full of spells? Hmm? Oh, no. This was my hand. Okay. Um, unfortunately, well, unfortunately, warp cards don't work very well. full of something, but it isn't spells. Uh, <laughs> that's yep. mean. Dad's here. Uh, all right. I'm going to ready. Sorry. This, uh, this bluey whitey. Makes sense. All right. Uh, and uh, then I guess I'll draw two. Ooh. And I'll just activate this now before the beginning of my turn, technically. It doesn't really matter. Find artifact. Draw one artifact from the artifact deck. Sweet. Oh. That's a nice spell. The Skull of Lore. Oh, nice. That's Tap. a fun one. Tap to roll one die on a... Uh, squid head, I discard it mm -hmm. and advance one on my summon track. Seems okay. That's what it's on for. On an Elder Star, I become cursed. You could use it right now before your turn starts. So you can unexhaust it. You know what? Seems I'm, right. I'm going to do it. All right. I'm going to live nasty. Oh, there's <gasps> nothing in there. Narrator. He didn't exhaust. need to tell us that he was going to live nasty, mm -hmm. but now we all know. Yeah, yeah. we knew. We've been done new. Uh... What? <laughs> <laughs> he was trying to say been done told. It's okay. Yeah. I want to curse you, but Great. I can't. Curse it up. I'm going to go purple. Sure, where are you going? Uh, purple. <laughs> Good. Snow time. Excellent. What have you done to me, Ben? I've become cursed. But that's so, my thing to do. Okay, mm -hmm. so now I read your card? I, no. I get his. Okay, that's fine. Yeah. Right, I'm on you. I can't remember. Okay. And my people go Got to it. thing. Yeah. And now I control the Elder World thing. That you do. And I'm going to roll, I guess, for other worlds. All right, three. I'm in there already. What you got? Uh, two, and I get one back. Yeah. So, I guess one there, one there, and I get two points. That so goes up, up to five. five. And I'm going to tip that skull. Okay. So, Gotta live nasty. I don't agree with that. I'm not currently living nasty. All right. All right. All right. All right. Live all nasty right. another day. Uh, we have a purple and a white, and that's not enough for me to do anything, so I'll just draw one. And that is my turn. Okay. I have the choice of how to move. Mm hmm. I can either spend one of these or both of them or both of that. So. That's decent, but I already have that. That's fine. I'm just going to spend... This is a little weird, but I'll spend two white to go to the white spot. Two? Uh, just to draw new things. Yeah, because I sure. draw back up to five. Yeah, sorry, these go... Oh, my bad, here. my bad. Go right there, yeah, sorry. This is mega... There's so much white stuff you over here. You can cast all of the planar cleansings when you leave that spot. Yeah. Okay. Um, going to white spot. That's right, the white yeah. spot. Okay, so I'm at the ceremony. Um, I will check. Okay. There aren't too many buds. I'll mm -hmm. put a bud in there. And then... Uh, how good is control in this spot again? What you get a warp. Yeah, you can sacrifice yeah. two Oh, friends. good. Yeah. You can sacrifice two guys to get another... You get even closer. Oh, you have victory. Yeah. Yeah, okay. Um, oh, I don't have any other buddies. I can't do it. Okay, sorry. I have mind switch. But I need to go somewhere else first. So I'll just roll for control, obviously. Did you, you get there? did not get that there. That is okay. Yeah, warp. I do get this. 
And you get to activate your ability. So I'll remove up to two When the cultists. first cult activates their ability... Dun dun dun! Yep. Each invocation agitates your elder god. Its hunger cannot be denied. Devour three of your cultists from the abyss, and sacrifice two of your cultists from the ceremony. Oh no! Great. Okay, so check it. I have literal zero guys on the board. No! Basically go in here. Does this still does this thing still activate? Sorry, no, you Sure. Uh, you, sac you sacrifice two of them, remove two of them. So they the go abyss, to the abyss, right? Yeah, right. Yeah. And then take three of them from the abyss. Yeah. And they go, yeah. okay, yeah. Alright, get sense. devoured. No, no, I don't know no, if they no, want to go no, somewhere no, else, no, but no, yeah, I'm imagining fine. they're in his belly. Um Does his ability still actually go though? I don't yeah. see why not. Yeah, it does. I would say so. Matt, give me two of your cultists from your lodge. Oh. They go to my lodge now. Okay, can I prepare a spell. There is yeah. a purple and a white. a white. And I have two green. Uh, yeah, I could do this one. This is a good one. Okay, so I have one that costs red, green, white. Okay. okay. And it provides a yellow. And then I don't get rated. I draw back up to five. And I'm done. Okay. Did I miss anything on my turn? I don't think so. Go. Okay. Man's turn now. Uh, on your end step, I'm gonna true magic. Yep. I'm gonna describe this spell. I like Nelson's Lodge. Just like, hey, uh, funny story. We just had some vacancies. <laughs> Why don't you guys come over here? Mm. And come then on tap. down. Uh, all right. Um, hey, guess what? I'm going to the other worlds. Oh. Uh, Checking. Everything's fine. Putting some homies there. Uh, I wish to roll to gain control. Uh, the other worlds. Nope. And you do not. Alright, I'm gonna roll for my friends. Sure. sure. It's two. Not they bad. both die and I get two points. Alright. Moving to three. Sacrificing cultists, the board game. Yeah, it's a good time. Uh, alright. Do I want to ready a spell? Uh, yeah, I'll ready this one that's uh, a red, uh, a yellowy and a whitey. Yep. Can't that's what I want, right? Yeah. And, white. and get rid of these magics. Uh, yeah. I've got two cards in hand. I will draw one, and it gets to Matt. Yeah, Griftastic, Griftastic one. We found out what uh, Gimp looks like. It's just this big frog. Yeah. Right. <laughs> <laughs> in Zed's basement. Okay, you did all your stuff. That's why he's wearing the leather mask. Ah, uh, two red. Two red. Where are you going? What up, Heather? The streets of our oh. camp. Hi, ho Heather. How are you doing? Hello. Uh, Hope you had a good stream. All right. So fine. There, I put my people there. Yeah. Roll for dominance. Yeah. Oh, can I respond? Sorry to the. Yep. Can I, bef when you land there, but before, mm -hmm. before you check to see if there's enough things. Yeah. So uh, these are technically not here right now. Right. Oh, you know what? Location or lodge? Any lodge? Nope. Forget it. Keep going. You're good. You're good. Uh, Classic board game things to say. Wait, I want to do something. Uh, I changed my mind. Nope. No control. So all I do here then is uh, place two people from the lodge or supply to any others. Yep, and then they raid. I wonder where. Oh no. Yeah, I okay. mean, if you end the game, you win. Yeah. All right, now I want to do a thing. I'm going to course the innocent to take two investigators from any one location or lodge and move them to any lodge. So. I'll take the two that were in mine. Give them to yours. Them in there. Yeah, so you could can have still some lose, two. technically. Sure could. Uh, uh, we, uh, we, we, I'm going to. I'm going to. True magic here, I guess. Sure. I'll discard this spell. Um, You're just doing a Hail Mary? Yeah. Am I rolling these dice or what? Yeah. Anyone else want to do anything? All right. Okay, do I roll dice for this too? No, it's no. other. Oh, everyone yeah, you else rated. Right. Sorry, yeah. Right, you just need two. Oh so. yeah, and you. I didn't even notice. I also have some. Yeah. You get rated too. We're good. Okay. I kicked them both out. Get out of here. Woo! All right, Exciting. I gotta do mine. This game is still afoot. When will it turn into a leg? I wonder. <laughs> uh, I also kick. Uh, oh, sorry. Wait, one more. 
All right, okay, I, take, I take seal, one, but, but I get rid all. of them all. Woo! You thought going to the streets of Arkham would get all the cops on everyone else's heels. Yeah. Not today! That's right. Wizard uh, lizard. You got the... Right, the branch, yeah. The branch? Mm -hmm. Yeah, yeah, he took yeah, a seal. He, got a branch. he took a seal, but the investigator didn't stay for yeah. the Elder Star. Yeah. I will cast a spell. Mm. Uh, <laughs> yellow and green. And it goes down here. Um, and then I am going to... So you spend these to do that, right? Uh, spend those, yeah. yeah. Uh, it didn't, yeah, I didn't have anything else to put there. Um, activate it. It's a witch's curse. Oh, I'm a witch and I'm cursing you. Great, curse Dang. me up. Uh, bring on the curses. Here you go. More curse. We like curse and we don't care who knows. <laughs> Great. Okay. And uh, what else do I want to do? I want to tap that skull and get nasty. Yeah. All right. Uh, Let's see what's inside the I skull mean, today. Promises, promises. But... Mm -hmm. Oh. Sorry, I cannot. No? You're not allowed to tap the skull? Discard. Oh, no. That's wait. only if you win, right? That's if you get if it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's, yeah, yeah. it's a one you, time it, you get a boost. It gets you one, oh, okay. one uh, point, but it can yeah. risk. Giving you a curse as many times as you want. Didn't do it. Just keep rolling yeah. tentacle. Yep. Really? Love nope. That tentacle. tentacle. Nope. Oops, all tentacle. Oops, all tentacle, exactly. Oops. Okay, I want to go to the green place so I can oh, get my. rid of a green or two yellow. Which uh, do I want to do with those? And yeah, my turn is done. So Okie dokie. On to you. Um, oh, I really like that one. Okay, I'm getting rid of two yellows. Mm -hmm. Two yellows. Going here. Right, sorry. In the green land where they're. Two whites worth of casting a spell. And then I will check to see if there's too many investigators. There aren't currently. I'll move one thing from my lodge into here, get an investigator into here. Then I'll roll for control, see mm -hmm. if I can mm -hmm. do more things that don't really matter. Didn't get it. That's fine. I just want to grab these three, move them into my lodge. Your lodge is so full. And then I can move one from the gathering to somewhere else. Is that right? Or from the gathering, not from your lodge. Not from my lodge. Just, mm -hmm. I just get three from the abyss in my lodge, right? Yeah. Okay, cool. Um, I'm gonna put them put this one into the ceremony. Ah. And then Intriguing. I, I might be able to cast a spell. Uh, I have three green and two white. No, I just can't. I can't cast a spell. So these white ones will stay here. I'm not getting raided. I will draw back up to five. It's, okay. It's Ben's turn. Uh, all right. Start of my turn. Uh, I guess this is untapping. Uh, I'm uh, I'm gonna find gate. Good. So I get to yeah. have a gate, but which you have uh, to use I, yeah, it. I have to use it. I'm gonna end up going to the uh, the cemetery. Does it go here? Or the, the, the Sorry, the, the, the card goes the here, though, right? Yes, it goes there. It's a yeah, it's a gate. Um, check in. Everything's fine. Cultist. Cultists. Uh, I get a gate. Uh. Guess what you is, don't have to roll for control. What does control no. do for you? Uh, I can sacrifice uh, two dudes to gain a uh, yeah, okay. thing. That's fine. Good. Uh, I get to activate my ability, though. Fun. The wind, howling wind, wind sound. Wind. Nice one. All right, friends. Matt, pick one. This one. Pick one. That one. Oh, the bottom one in my hand. Okay. There. And I'll pick this one. Perfect. There. That's there. much easier than shuffling. Way easier. Hold All right. We'll figure um, it out. Go there. Um, there. And go there. All right. Uh, from here, destroy mats. Uh, from here, uh, do I have to? Actually, you should have Ooh. double checked that. Right. Uh, destroy you... from each of those locations. Ah, shoot. Do you want to move it? Is it cool if I move it? Yeah, it's fine. Okay. I mean, it's fine with me. Yeah. Okay. I'm fine with that. Uh, we'll go here. There. Um, sure. Yeah, we'll go Destroyed like ones all go here, right? Yeah, so I did... Uh, I haven't destroyed one from here, so I'll destroy the one Matt has. I just tried three. Keep holding green. No, they go here. Yes, they sorry. Here. That's yeah. okay. 
Um, okay. Yeah, the, the Wendigo really like keeps the board clear. It's not just me, yeah. obviously. Mm -hmm. Now Matt only has three cultists on the, on the board. Uh, all right, I can prepare an ability, so I will... There are more investigators than there are cultists right now. Oh, yeah. yeah. Uh, oh, <laughs> I'll, I'll do this one. Can you it's imagine? double green. It's like, you can see inside the inner workings of the police department, and there's just like 40 cops working on, like, guy. trying to bust these two dudes. Yeah. Uh, and then I'll draw back up to three. That's my turn. I like Sweet. the three cops that somehow yeah. ended up in the outer wild, uh, the outer worlds with no actual... Yeah, there's no cults there, yeah. <laughs> it's, it's like... We're in this like crazy MC Escher like weird void area. Yeah. Why are we even here? There's nothing to investigate. Oh, Paul, you're not caught up on Matt's points. He has five. Yeah. 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 yeah someone was asking. Yeah, and I'm at tree. Uh, question. Yep. Is there a cap on artifacts? Uh, I don't think so. I don't know. We de I don't remember being told there was. Um. That's a good question. Uh, you cult, your cult can hold a maximum of three. If you acquire a fourth, you must immediately discard one. Matt, I guess the museum sounds pretty dope right now. I'm liking the idea of visiting uh, a museum. Ben, did you do the thing where you sacked the two guys to... Uh, oh yeah, did you, you had control. I forgot again you, about you it again. It? Uh, you want it's fine, it was just now. Sure. Okay. Did you ready a spell? Uh, I did. Okay, so we sh those should be gone then. No, I added. Oh, he you just oh, did that, that. Okay, yeah. okay, and that's your. Yeah, I'll go to four. Well. I gotta cool. catch up okay, to Matt. So, Matt's a five. Ben's a four. And it's seven. Mm -hmm. So I'm going to roll for control. Yeah. I do not get it. I've not gotten it once this time. Uh, museum. I may take one face up. End of list. I get that cane. That cane, though. All right. Matt's got a lot of rolly abilities. Mm -hmm. I guess the cane really works for the skull, don't it? Yeah. Uh, we've got the Forgotten Tome, which is you can tap it or exhaust it. <laughs> Whenever uh, another cult moves to the library, draw two spell cards. Mm. Uh, and the, ooh, the Crown of Cargo or Carcosa. You may roll two dice when rolling for temporary control. If you yeah. roll uh, double uh, stars, though, then you become cursed and you have to destroy this. Nice. Yeesh. That's kind of interesting. So I am going to tap that skull of lore and live nasty. And I uh, did it. I, right. I advance one on my summon track to six. Nice. Victory and points. Discard. Yep. Smash that. And I do not have to use my enchanted cane. <laughs> cool. There you go. Uh, beyond that, I'm going to draw a card, I believe. I don't need that. Matt's getting there, but he's doing it quietly. All right, there you go. <laughs> I think it's not so quiet now. He's only one point behind me. All right. Well, but he's, Your he's, turn. He's not attracting the investigators. Oh, right. Yeah. yeah. He has none of the. He has none of the. the Right, I guess technically up. we don't want to do it because you might discard more to go into the shuffle. Sure. Mm -hmm. So it's my turn. Yep. I wouldn't mind asking for strategy help from the other players. I you... know we're you know competing. There's big sure about well, like what you should do right now. Yeah. So I have one cultist on the ceremony. <sighs> yeah. So if I land there, I have like mind swap, but I don't have any other cultists I can move in. Right. Um, so what's your your Special ability to do? You can eat I can, some dudes yeah. to gain a thing. Any so I get to do that, no matter... If I go to the ceremony, I can definitely get one, if yeah. I'm still alive. You can only eat one guy, though. Only one. Do you have a way to get another homie on there? No. I, uh, like, if I had another homie on the board, I could. Because that's the thing, right, is you could effectively, I but guess, it's, get it's two. Only if I, it's like, if I go and I roll a six right now, then I could win this turn. Mm -hmm. Or I could just go somewhere else, try not to die, and then set up. The problem is... Literally every square has three investigators. Yeah. Well, I say you should go for it. You think I should? And you don't get a raid, six? right? Yeah. It you doesn't raid right away. Raid. No, that's true. What? Yeah, there's three guys on there, isn't there? Yes, yeah, but you just pick them up, but you don't get raided until you have five. Um, the only way. Oh, is right. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. I so I think you should do it. Well. Yeah. Okay. But the th yeah. Okay. I think I it makes the most sense. I probably should because I can go to the ceremony again next year unless someone's there. So, you have a one in six chance of just one in winning. Six chance of just winning. Okay. And then alternatively picking up an extra one somewhere um, else. I need to make sure that like I'm not steering you into a bad zone here. No, that's fine. That's fine. 
I mean, you guys can still try to stop me. Obviously, that's how the game works. Yeah. Um, okay, I just got to decide if I'm spending a white card or this purple card. Um, yeah, this doesn't really do anything. I have this purple card. Just asking asking help from your opponents is a bold strategy. Yeah, yeah. yeah I feel like I, oh know, yeah, honestly, no, I just an yeah. spot and yeah. I thought it would make for a decent. Um, I'm I'm totally in with that. On ceremony a lot. Yeah, I like the idea of, of letting people know I what I'm thinking. A gate card. Sure, Great. have a gate card. That's awesome. Okay, so I get there. There are too many buds, so yeah. I, I put them in here, and then add one. Add one. Mm -hmm. Add one. You roll get a to six. You just win. Right. Roll to try to win the game. Come on, Cthulhu head. Okay. So instead, I just eat this one so it gets into the belly. Yeah. I move up one on the track, right? Mm hmm. And then I. Move on to the ready a spell. Yeah, just ready a spell. Okay, cool. There's. You don't, a also, you don't also get to add more people, right? It's either either or? Yeah. I either eat two from another lodge or I devour. Yeah. Remove one from another lodge, put in my lodge, or devour one from my lodge. Yeah. Okay, so I have, sorry, green, green, white. Wild, um, I can only cast this one, but that's okay. This is a pretty good one. Yeah, I have a white yellow. White so yellow. I can cast that off the place. I use up that purple to purple. do so. Three green in my zone. Okay, and now we're all done. I have to grab two cards. So we're going to shuffle these, right? Yes. Yeah. yeah. Okay. Is that the, that's the end of my turn? turn? Yes. Yeah. Okay, well, at least I got to eight victory points. Um, if I die. keep expecting Nelson to just suddenly pull out that right. card that gives you like two victory points. Uh, I'm gonna Never. true magic, I guess, on my end step. Yep, to, sorry. Uh, okay. Yeah, no, it's all good. So Matt's at the point now where he just wants to send investigators to Nelson. I mean, that's been the whole game. I've yeah. lived that life. I know what it's like, and I think you would appreciate it too. <laughs> I'm sure I would. Okay. Um, what do I want to do here? Did you, what did your true magic do? I I get to draw the top. I I discard one of my spells. I discard this one. and I draw the top one. I ready it. Oh, okay. Yeah. So you just kind of. I just swap through. Yep. Yeah. You get a free random spell. Oh right, sorry. Then I have to drop to five when you're done doing that. Yeah. I was in the middle of doing that. That's okay. No, go for it. Yeah. Okay, cool. It's Drawing up to five. Yeah. Uh. All right. So I'm on tippity tapping. What am I doing? Where are you going? I don't know, man. What's your plan there, Snowman? I feel like the game is just about done, and I'm uh, I, I'm just not close. Well, if you You're not go, that far away from me. If you go somewhere, and then Matt goes to the ceremony, I can't go to the ceremony next turn. Yeah, but, but I can try to win on the other world. I feel like there's no but way at Matt... At least it's a try. I feel like there's no way there's, that Matt's not going to Arkham. Okay. He just puts a bunch of dudes on your thing, right? And then you get raided and lose. Well, why don't you just assume... Yeah, assume that that fails and... Well, okay. Yeah, I don't know. Sorry. Maybe yeah. your turn kind of doesn't matter, and I'm either losing on Matt's turn, and Matt's winning, or I'm winning on my turn. I'm not mm. sure if anything it's else can stop there. Can just you live in life? Can okay. you can you break my seals? You don't want to do that because you don't want to just help me win. You're in an awkward spot. Mm. It's not that I'm headed, helping you win as much as I just don't want you to lose. Right. It would seem. Go sure, you could go to the. Seals. The thing is, it. if you spend your resources trying to break my seals, and then. Matt instead just goes to the ceremony yeah. to stuff me from winning. I'm gonna go to the museum. Then you get another turn. Yeah, I'm gonna do like Zo. Okay. Uh, I got control of the museum. Fun. Um, I'm gonna, before I draw the things, sure. bust sure. these. Look at some new stuff. Flip some new stuff what here. What do we got in the museum? We got the Scepter of Elders. It can be exhausted to sacrifice one uh, cultist from any location to flip one of my dice to the opposite face. Whoa, neat. Oh, it is that's, neat. That's cool. Uh, and the Elder Mask, which is during your turn, place an additional uh, bad homie. And uh, I can get rid of it to uh, not get any homies. I guess I'll take the Scepter. Seems, Seems kind of interesting. Um, get rid of that. Nobody wants that. And you automatically mask. have control here. Yeah. Yeah, so that, that's why I was doing the thing. We got the Dust, which is the counter spell. And the Silver Key, which is the you can scoop people around. Mm-hmm. Um, scoot, scoot. I can ready a spell. Uh, oh, and control means that you can sack up to three guys. To yeah, to to get rid of uh, up to those that amount of elder seals on somebody. I'm assuming you can split that up however you want. Yeah, yeah. you can do them. You can do any of them. 
No, any of the I'm many not going to do that. Just not going to do it. Get rid yeah. of all of your elder seals. Uh, I need. I kind of want to keep those friends there, though. Fair. Um. It was fair. Narrator. Fair. It was fair. Yeah. Uh, I will ready this. Uh, this bluey greeny. Bluey greeny. Uh, let me just go away. Uh, I've got one card in hand, so I'm going to draw two. Uh, and that is uh, Decimi. That's a you? Mm -hmm. I unexhaust. I shall go through the warp. That goes there. Oh, yeah, sorry. No worries. Through the warp to confusing. Arkham. All right. What did first, I give you, first Matt? Snow. All cults sacrifice one person from this location, then destroy one uh, seal from their summon track. Right. Whoa. <laughs> okay. I don't have anyone there, but you I still don't. get to blow up a seal, nope. right? No. No? Yes or no? Do I sacrifice a seal? I don't know. Yeah. All cults sacrifice friend and then destroy. I would assume it's like... And then not if they did? Yeah. I would say that it's a seal. It doesn't say if they did. Okay. Hmm. I am sacrificing all of the people I have yeah. here. So that's one of you is mm -hmm. sacrificed. One yeah, of one of you. Sacrifice. Okay. Um, check. I get the people. Okay. Down to seven seals. I've heard that the seventh seal is an important one. <laughs> Turns out the tenth seal is all right. Really you're going to roll one. for control? I'm going to roll for control. Nope. Okay. I have three. Ben has zero. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. So I get to give to you. And you can take them from your place, too, oh, if you yeah. like. Oh, good. Thank you. I'm going to give them to you. <laughs> sure. Yeah. Seems right. And I'm going to activate nothing. Don't I just... I have... This raid happens right away, doesn't it? Isn't that part of Street Spoken? Yeah, it does. It's gonna happen right. Did, away. did you want to do something before you give me them, or uh, cast a spell or anything? Or the raid happens, and okay. this is what I was remembering. Okay. When if the cursed cult is raided. Oh uh, <laughs> yeah. no! The investigators are more tenacious than you had imagined. Mm. All squid heads are considered elder stars. For this <laughs> raid. Okay. Well played, Matt. Uh, I mean, for the purposes of this, that doesn't actually make that much difference because that just means that. Oh no, squid heads. Squid heads. So there's yeah. only two yeah, safe yeah. numbers. Yeah. Yeah. After roll. Four safe sides. Yeah. Four. Sa <laughs> Sorry. Two. Safe two sides. safe sides. Four dead sides. Yeah. yeah. And I have to roll five. So yeah, I have to roll. You gotta get a lot of tentacles. Yeah. I have to roll two. Nope. Yeah. Nope. Tentacles. You have to roll. So you have to. I have to get three tentacles. There goes that die. It's all right. There's five in there. Yeah. I know. I have to. Yeah. Three tentacles. You have to get at least three, three tentacles. tentacles. Three all right. tentacles. Okay. So this is happening. Anyone doing any more things before it happens? We'll see what the roll of the dice is. Sure, yeah. sure, sure. Okay. All right. Oh, I did. Oh, well, I don't know. It's tentacles. cocked. What do you think? Is that okay? I would. I can't see it. So. I would. Is that a tentacle? It's I would mostly call tentacle. That's a tentacle. Yeah. Okay, so you're still getting two though. Or right. this is what? This is a star, right? Yeah. It counts as a star. Uh, all right. I'm gonna use uh, the spell that I had prepped. The stars are right. Is Assign it? each cult. This is the modal one. Okay. Oh, okay. Nelson, you can yep. lose an Elder Seal. Okay, I will lose an Elder, elder Seal. Uh, Matt, uh, I'm going to curse you. I am cursed. Um, oh, I have two curses. Yeah, now. you do. Woof. Uh, and I will uh, gain two friends from the Abyss. Okay, mm. I'm also going to cast a spell. It's Transmogrify. I change any run, roll, die to any face. Hilariously, I'm changing the squid head. To a tentacle. So you're not going to take any? No, I... St yeah, I don't want to take any you seals. Take Why do you take one? Once... Well, you take one, but he gained... But he lost one as well, so... Oh, yeah. right. Oh, so right, you're I back do. to... Oh, right, I do have... I only have one of these from my friends. Right, I forgot. Okay, cool. That scar still gives me one. But I, at least I'm getting rid of all my investigators. Okay, um... And I also get cursed. Mm hmm I'm, I'm opting for a curse so instead of... So you're back of, at where you were. Yes, there. I'm going to grab one right now and get rid of all the investigators. All right. Of that. So right. Nelson is still at uh, seven seals. Still at yeah, seven seals. Nothing changed. Well, we spent some stuff. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. And now there are more curses around. Yeah. This this is getting intense. Yeah. It's a similar it number of curses. Yeah. Okay. Mm -hmm. So 
Thanks. That was your action for Streets of Arkham. That was my action. There's a ton of yellow there, and I have one green, but that's not enough for anything, so I'm just going to draw a card. And that is my turn. Okay. I have a white or a warp or two green. Assuming this game keeps going. Do I want the... I mean, that's pretty good. What about the two green? Hmm. Um, yeah, I don't... Ah, whatever. I'll just use this warp. Okay, so put the warp here to go to the white place. To the white place. Is that okay? Mm -hmm. I get a warp card from you yes, going you to do. the white place. I will put one of my people in here as well as one one investigator that Ben mm. described. Uh, oh, he's going for the win. I am. Does anyone want to cast any spells? Man, I really am the kingmaker here. Uh, do, you want, do you want me to win or do you want... Like, Matt's yeah, winner, Nelson just Well, I was saying that to continue the game. All right, yeah, I'm going to yeah. true magic one of my okay. spells here. All right, yep. Ben is moving his pieces about deviously, keeping us from ending the stream. It's true. Yeah, for the yeah. players. It's fine. it's fine. For the players, the stakes have never been lower. For yeah. the world, it could be bad. Yeah, exactly. If you like being eaten by a giant huh. frog, okay. guess what? That's a cool ability. Life is about to get great for you. Uh, that's, uh... Am I, am I cursed to lose if I would win? We're gonna find out in a second here. Am I? I have two curses as well. Oh, right, yeah. Yeah, no, that's, uh... This is that's bad. it. Okay, I... so... He doesn't have any curses that are hurting him right now? Well, we're gonna find out. Maybe I go to... I have to try to do it, and then maybe I lose instead, right? Um, so I'm in ceremony. I gain a gate card. Yeah. I'm in control, but that doesn't matter right now. I gain a gate card, and then I eat this from yep. my lodge to gain a victory point. And you win. No, it's one more, isn't it? No, it's right that one. Oh, is it? It's nine. Nine, nine is the top, isn't it? Yeah. Oh. Yeah. Cool. Did you want to do something different, given that it's nine, or...? Um, I mean, you can't change the course of a curse, so no. Okay. <laughs> All right. Oh. All right, Nelson wins. It. The big frog yeah. ate enough people. Holy moly, that was really close. To, to enter the world and uh, begin Armageddon. So if you're uh, in, if you're in Oklahoma, yeah, uh, apparently that's where this guy hangs out. He's, oh, uh, yeah, the uh, Sa Satogua uh, yeah. is uh, underground in Oklahoma, and that's oh. why it's okay. Oh, Right. Yeah. No, I'm sure that won't affect any places except Oklahoma. Well, there you go. Only yeah. Oklahomans will be in danger. Congratulations, Nelson, on Thank uh, you. raising your god. I'm glad we got both Thank kinds. The narc victory and the <laughs> and the, the actual, actual summoning victory. victory. Yeah, this game I, is really I, cool. I had an interesting yeah. run here where it was like, that. the second game was even more exciting where it seemed like constantly I was going to lose to seals. Yeah. The first game felt ended more abruptly, whereas this one was like, there was a full turn where I was like, okay, Nelson's going to go for it. Yeah. Can yeah. we stop him or do we want to right yeah it's, yeah it's really interesting uh so thank you so much for tuning on into afk today i hope you had uh ha had as much fun as we did this is really sweet and maybe it's inspired you to, to also play it a uh, reminder that this stream is brought to you by the amazing folks over at warpwoodgaming.com uh if you uh, want to get one of their amazing products like this uh, dice tray that we used all the the whole stream and they're they're super nice they would smell real good as you can see they taste really good I was thinking about licking it, and then I'm like, there's children yeah, in some yeah. time zone, maybe. Don't lick your wood on stream, Nelson. Uh, in, in, if you live in the U.S., you can use code LRR for free shipping, and everywhere else, you can use code LRR World for $10 off shipping. Paul? Wormwood Gaming, the bones of trees and the skins of beasts. <laughs> and a reminder that everything we do is brought to you by you over at uh, our Patreon at patreon.com slash loading ready run uh you're the reason you're able to do all this kind of stuff so we really really appreciate it and if you and if you did enjoy consider uh, checking checking it out you know it it, it helps us out a lot surprise benefits yeah and yeah. uh speaking of sweet surprise benefits and stuff like that reminder that uh monday is uh what we is, got going on monday is is road quest the, the first premiere. episode of road quest drops mm -hmm. on you yeah. for yeah four o'clock youtube premiere uh, so like check, a sack of wrenches. Check that out. Of course, uh, once that is uh, broadcast, it'll be just available on our YouTube account. Yeah. So. Uh, and yeah, I mean, speaking of things coming up, Paul, uh, what do we got in streams for the rest of the the week? Uh, well, we got Checkpoint Plus happening tomorrow with uh, Graham and Beige and myself, and uh, then we got LRRMTG 
playing some of the uh, magical cards. Probably Throne of Eldraine draft. A little mm-hmm. uh, Throne mm-hmm. of Eldraine drafting. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, Betrayal Legacy. It's back. <laughs> On uh, on Thursday night. Yeah. How many sessions into this legacy run is it? Do you know? Uh, seven. Oh, well, yeah. sorry, four, like four or five sessions, but we're on game Wait. like seven or eight. Oh, okay. Yeah. Cool. We yeah. haven't played in a while. Just there's been some sicknesses and stuff. I, yeah, That's rather appropriate. It's, it's betrayal at the house on the hill, right. and the last. We ended the last session. There was no house. Yeah, the house, the house is, is gone. It, 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 it's hard it's, to stay warm and yeah, and, and yeah, clean it's and kind of healthy destroyed. when you don't have a house. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, and then Friday, we've got the return of the Highlander Winter League with right. uh, Nelson. Including me. Yeah, yeah, yeah I'm going to be sitting this one out, and Nelly's going to take my spot. Tagged in. Mm-hmm. Got to take it to the... What are you playing? Uh, uh, are you keeping that surprise. secret? No, I'll right. talk about it. It's fine. Yeah, we, no, we can, I can talk about it. I'm considering either Red Deck wins. Yeah, is my it, boy. Is it Tempo, yeah. uh, Demon Stompy, or Cradle Huff. Those are kind of the decks I have. I don't think anyone's really mind. brought Huff for like. Oh, really? We're not really hosting. Although this is the one yet. that uh, you guys, we're, you're going back to kind of changing it whenever you the deck. This, right? yeah. So another news about this league is going to be um, we can change our decks from week to week. Yeah. So we're not doing we're not doing committing to one and running it through the whole league this time. Mm-hmm. Uh, we might in the future, but this time we're going to just going to be swapping the decks out. Awesome. As if you want, you know. Yeah. Yeah. Cameron, I mean, Cameron might play Risk Cats every single week. Yeah, it's up to you. You're, you're, like not, a, you're not like shackled to a yes, deck. Yes, exactly. Yeah. Uh, and then on Saturday, Adam's Game House playing the Persona Five. We must be getting pretty deep in that too now. Yeah. yeah. Probably. A few mm-hmm. so. yeah. And Lone Red Live. Oh, it's a yeah. live week. Wow. Oh, cool. Day. Yeah, for nice. uh, October's Loading Ready Live. What's going to happen? We don't know. Probably something Halloweeny, or at least Pro- like probably. October themed. Yeah, so or maybe fall themed. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, we're saving saving our uh, October Halloween themed episode for January. Yeah, <laughs> <laughs> why not? Today is good. This time it's going to be our Christmas episode. Yeah, <laughs> wow, that would, that would upset we're, people. We're, yeah. we're very confused. <laughs> Uh, and then uh, on play it f- on uh, Saturday evening, uh, Surge is gonna start his play it forward of Moonlighter. This game is That's sweet. Cool. Yeah, he's excited. Yeah, about I've it. actually it's a lot of fun. I've been playing this at home actually a little bit. Yeah, and uh, yeah, yeah, it's super fun. Yeah, it's really neat. Uh, and Rhythm Cafe on Sunday, Muse Dash. God, Rhythm games always look so cool. <laughs> they do. Yeah. They it, it kind of reminds me of like. If you ever, you ever in in Canada, there we have got there on the there's like the French Channel. Yeah, is like Channel Three, mm. uh, and as with a lot of foreign language channels, or not foreign, language, but you know, as a lot of language channels where you don't understand, they seem like they're having a lot more fun they on do. the French language <laughs> channel yeah. than they are on the English it's channel. It's so true. Yeah. And sometimes I get that, I feel like that with rhythm games. It's like, this game looks like fun, but I don't understand any of it. Yeah. <laughs> but they seem to be having fun. Yeah, yeah. 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 Uh, and then on Sunday night, more play it forward with the surge continuing on with Moonlighter. And then a uh, new little uh, mini Dice Friends campaign. Just, yeah. Uh, cool. Just going to be three shots. So this is, again, mentioned uh, we've got uh, uh, the... Road Quest premiere at four o'clock, and then right afterwards at five, uh, Cam is going to be doing a little uh, three-shot adventure. Uh, that is, uh, I don't know if we're releasing too much info about it, but I believe it is probably tell say the players yeah. at least. Yeah. Uh, and yeah, so who are, who are the players actually? It's uh, Matt. Yep, and, and Erica from Desert Bus. Yeah, yeah from Desert Bus. And Kathleen mm-hmm. and Serge, I believe. Nice. That'll be yeah. a lot of fun. It's a good and, little crew. Do we know and, what game uh, we're playing? It's going to be on. Uh, it's going to be back on uh, Ravnica. I yeah. Think. Oh, okay. So probably D and D. Yeah. Yeah. It's a D and D. Yeah. yeah. I know they they well that that last campaign with Dale was that wasn't D and D right? Yeah. yeah it was kind of a different yeah. rule set, right? Yeah. So. Yep. 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 Cool. Back on D and D Ravnica. Exciting. Mm-hmm. So it's going to be super cool. Mm-hmm. So uh, yep. Cam did talk about it on. Uh, oh, brand new face. Oh, there we go. There you go. We didn't think it was super secret. Mm-hmm. Hopefully. Okay. I, yeah, yeah, yeah. I just, uh, yeah, I'm never quite sure, like, how far, ha- how much uh, is we're, we're we're revealing about. Yeah, things. eventually yeah. you don't wanna, you don't wanna, especially when like it's it could be camp. Cam wants to keep his 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 trade secrets. There's going. enough of us on in LRR that have enough toes that we 
try to make sure we don't step on them. Yeah. Because they are all over the place. There's just... So many toes. There's just people's toes just flying around yeah. in the hallway. Yeah. And uh, speaking about flying around in the hallway, we should get to some of these subs. <laughs> I don't know. I tried. <laughs> that was a good segue. Sure, that, that's, that's what we were talking about. Yeah. Smooth. smooth. Alley -oop. I alley -ooped that one for you. Uh, that's how smooth it was. Yeah, so. yeah thanks. <laughs> thanks to everybody who supports us in all the many ways that you do. But in particular, we want to thank the people who subscribed during the stream, starting with Nelson. It's Broken Golem for 35 months. Thanks so much. Snakebite36 for eight months. Welcome back. Mm -hmm. And welcome back to Chicky49 for the first time of many. Thanks, Dahlgren, for 14 month subscription. Appreciate it. And Frank and Fruity for 44 months. Good to see you again, friend. Thank you. Mm -hmm. Thank you for the support of Asriel02, another new subscriber. Thank mm -hmm. you for joining us. Thanks, kid. Flashable for two months now. I couldn't have eaten all the cultists without you. Uh, atomic Marshmallow for 35 months. It was not the atomic bomb that did it this time. It was a big old frog. Yeah. Mantifold for 18 months. Is that what that frog was? Captain Fuse for six months. You tried to investigate me, and I will never forget it. <laughs> uh, Bolton Fees for 35 months. Welcome back, friends. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Wonder Wonder for three months. Thank you for coming back again. Lunar Eclipse, 123 for 39 months now. Thanks for helping us keep on the lights so we don't have to rely on one of you. Gwaldar, 29 months. Holy moly, thank you. Mm -hmm. uh, don't ping me, please, for 10 months. Thank you for returning. Garrick, Predator of Scrubs for 13 months. Thanks for taking care of the scrubs for us. Good thing you weren't at our gaming table. Stefan JM81 for 32 months. Thank you, friend. Welcome back. Death Mints for 21 months. I hope you get that dealt with. Hazio Sora for 25 months now. Thanks for the sub. Matrix Knight 88 for 22 months. I believe in you. Mm. Snow E Wolf for 11 months. It's becoming that season. Damn, I am pretty. True. For 47 months now. And so are you. The Behemoth Barn. That's where you store all your behemoths. For yep. 21 months. Welcome back. Doom four one one four four one four months. <laughs> you sounded like a voicemail machine. <laughs> Doctor Shandor, it's been thirty-seven months. We appreciate it, bud. Uh, Crumpler sixty-four, the uh, lesser-known uh, uh, console from back in the day. <laughs> and Bus Ted for sixty-two months. I guess that time is coming soon. Yep, Vera Phage knows it as well, and has known it for 54 months now. Thank you. Viperous Planet. That's where we crash-landed for 19 months. Mm -hmm. more for three months. Thank you. Forever Backwards for 34 months now. Thanks for the resub. 30 cubic feet of salsa oh, for I 21 wish. months. Welcome mm. back. That's so much salsa. Yum. Yeah, and Kung Fu Banana for 25 months. That's getting to be a spotty banana. Jelka Mantis, 38 months now. Thanks for continuing to mantis. T Dum Kampf. Thanks for camping here for 11 months. Snurky for 47 months. Thank you. Big thanks to Bad Virtue 0667 for four months now. Maelstrom Solnor for 22 months. Good to see you, friend. Mm -hmm. Basil Hunter for 34 months. Kind of basil. Yep. Revenant 77X being spoopy for 31 months now. Peter 200LX for 38 months. Good to see you. Mm -hmm. And the Cardiac People for, for nine months. I believe that's everyone. Transcast for 35 months. Thanks. <sighs> Paravale for 36 months. That's three years. Mm -hmm. This Todd for 35 months. This who? This Todd. Vorpal Warhammer for 22 months now. I could have said that normal, maybe. Uh, Babonic Mind is a brand new sub. You came for this? Mm -hmm. Zale 250 for 31 months. You know who pays homage to the Elder Gods? It's the ghost with the most for 26 months now. Okay, 69, nice. 60 for 34 months. And Black Wolf for 69 nice months. Thank you for getting into the giant lizard frog demon's belly, Broken Golem. Didn't I already thank you once? Yeah. Broken Golem? Broken sub list, more like it. <laughs> Jasaria for 20 months, damn. 
and Squirrel Earl for 47 months. 47 squirrely months. Thanks, Torvendi, for all 35 months now. Thanks for the uh, eight months there, Keldron TV. Really appreciate it, eh? Mm -hmm. True Diamond back for 16 months. You are a true diamond. Thank you for these 41 months of show, Trob. Soulless Gamer. Hey, Adam subbed. Thanks. Oh, Burns. <laughs> PK Jester for 31 months. You almost got me. Thanks. Go to Pygmy90 for three months now. Hope you get to 90 months. Thanks. Dead Rekka for 60 months. Good to see you, friend. Mm -hmm. And Mnemonic Man for 18 months. Thanks for making that hard to say. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks, Drago Knight 101 for all 18 months of your sub. Captain Ender 7 for 71 months. Hello. Mm -hmm. And Sing O Muse for five <laughs> months. Beautiful. Thanks, A. Eric, for 70 months now. Khaled, uh, Khaled, 69 months. Nice. Commander Pulsar for seven months. Powerful. Thanks, Kazuki. 22 months now. We appreciate it. Doom limit for 53 months. Hopefully that's not the limit. Yeah. yeah. Hunter Prime for 35 Hunter-filled months. Thanks to Transient Poe for 13 months, and I hope you find somewhere to settle down eventually. <laughs> for 35 months. Hey, friend. Thank you. I know that guy. And I know <laughs> Demolit14. 70 months of friendship. Thank oh you. Oh my gosh. Thanks, Curative Plague, for all that you do. These <laughs> 16 months now. Ah, the Curative Plague. Life yeah. character for 36 months. That's three years. Hex Moosey for four months. Thank you. Thanks for coming back for nine months now, you kitty. Pepper slapping. 69 months of slapping that Peppers. Okay then, Marlene Spike 19, 20 months, you went over 19. Trident 042 for 15 months now. Soul Eater 5210 for 11 months, good to see you again friend. Thank you very much. And Clever Crumblish for 51 months of support, thank you. Thanks Roland Malius for 51 months as well. Thanks Squid Pope for 46 months. God. Uh, and thank you so much uh, for all these gifts from Goblin Ranger to uh, Metric Furlong, Arkham Archivist, Anonny Man 41, Rekus, and Dinks! Dinks. Dinks. Thank and you. Infinity to Plank for 48 almost infinite months. Finally, thanks to Muddy Thunder for 15 months now. And oh, for all damn bits, We've got uh, 5,056 bits from Yon Lance, Shirts, Urban Samurai 22, Dungeon Master 099, E Block, Lunar Eclipse 123, Driosynth, Pharaoh Bender 27, Boy Jenny, 321 Pants Off, Aquinas 0, Z Alpha, Lumlight, Not Kane or Abel, and Banriel, Da Bits. Thanks, da Bits. Da Bits. Thank you very much, everyone, for tuning on in. And for all your support, we really, really appreciate it. Uh, next week is a spoopy game. I looked at my calendar. I didn't write it down. I, I, I tried this time. It's uh, going to be even spoopier because of the surprise. Yeah, sometimes I rely on James too much, I guess. Yeah. Uh, but, uh, yeah, it'll be... Oh, I think it might be Mansions of Madness. Maybe? Maybe? Man yeah. <laughs> Mansions of Madness. I think it's madness. Mansions of Madness. Or something even scarier. Yeah, or something else. Either way, it'll be fun. So, we'll see you around. Bye, friends. Night, night. Bye.